Please, man, that's like Hi. the beginning. Hi. Just Hi. stop it, stop Hi. it, stop it. This is, let me at least name, like, name the podcast. It's Late Night Coffee Podcast, formerly known as Enjoy Getting Fuck Podcast. My name is Alex, and today with me is uh, the motherfucker, the fucking, um, uh, the alcoholic, the alcoholic with, uh, with extreme mood swings. Uh, who stood me up the last time? So uh, me and uh, our production guru Richard uh, were forced uh, to have almost a three-hour conversation. Kevin, it sounds really enjoyable to talk for three hours. It, I, I, I agree. It was, uh, it was a little bit dragged out, right? Probably. Yeah. It was dragged I'm out. I'm so sad I missed out. Oh no, my no, god. No, no, it was dragged out. But I don't, I don't. <laughs> I don't believe in the concept of a three-hour co- three-hour conversation being, uh, you know, boring. Like in general, no, no, there no, can be three-hour conversations that are actually very dynamic and interesting. Right? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. And sometimes you need those super long conversations to fill fill the gaps. For example, I have a buddy of mine who travels like three hours a day to work, and then and then he really enjoys the long-form podcasts because exactly. because you can cover the whole road yeah. by just one. One, one thing and not like jump between. Fair enough. So like you, you like you got you you got like when you when you listen to a like a three hour podcast or a recording or mm. whatever, you like you got you got shit like you're not you're probably not focusing all three hours. Well, you're, I mean, I don't, I don't, I, I, I think, don't I think people think tend to space well. out, so it's just so s- some parts of it just just are, are just left in the background. Yeah, and then I you guess kinda, then you kind of focus back, then yeah. you space out again. You hear something that you're that 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 you know catches your ear, and you're like, oh, this is this, this is something that interests me. I'm 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 gonna get back to this. I mean, uh, then again, there are people who, who might be you know focused. I think the I think the people who are focused. Mm listening to like a three hour three hour podcast episode i think those are the people who are like actually fans of the of the, of the people who are making the podcast fans of the podcast. or there's something really interesting as a title for three hours i don't know you can talk about a lot of shit for three hours that's the point it's just the subjects like is, no i i could can talk you talk about, about can you talk about one topic for three hours yeah you just uh you branch off a little bit but you're still talking about the thing yeah, but then, then, but, but you, it requires you're planning, not, though. Like that it requires w- planning. What, what I mean is that you can talk about a tomato for three hours, but you can't talk about a tomato without mentioning vegetables. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, yeah. Or, but uh, for or me, what? cars. <laughs> I mean, you. Can, I don't. I've never. I've never Best heard. Example. I mean, I haven't listened to all of the podcasts that exist. Yeah. But I've never heard a podcast episode. That is uh, that is long as fuck, and actually stays on the topic from from the first minute till the end. All right, all right. They, I well, mean, my there's, my there's best example be is the uh, NPR, uh, yeah. TED Radio Hour, mm-hmm. and they have like, t- I think the maximum that I've it's listened to half, is like, no? yeah, it's it's usually an hour and a half or like fifty minutes. Gotcha. But st- I've listened to one that's like an hour forty. Yeah, that was great. Hour yeah. forty, right? Not yeah. three hours. No, no, still not three hour hours. Hour forty, I think. Yeah, but you can stick to the, you can stick to the subject. Yeah, yeah. but uh, like for me, I don't know. I I find it weird that there's one like one thing for three hours. Yeah. When when I go, no, no, saying, no, yeah. no, no, like one podcast. I want to switch it up a little bit because like when I go running, that's when I listen to podcasts the most. Yeah. And I listen to like to NPR radio hour. Yeah. yeah, it's interesting. I, 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 I can't focus on it. Like, I, when I listen to a podcast, I want to focus on it. Yeah. Because I'm, because in general, I'm going to listen to a, to a podcast of the people whose, uh, whose opinion on whatever they're talking about I'm interested in. Yeah, for sure. for sure. So while running or doing any other kinds of sports, it's just kind of, it to me, it will fade into the background. Oh, no. The thing, it, it actually helps for me. Like, yeah. when I run, I just listen to the podcast and I forget about running. I still oh, keep... you forget my, about... Okay. Yeah. Gosh. So you can, like, get way further. Yeah. Without a podcast, I'm always... I'm thinking about running and it's yeah. really annoying. It's like, oh, my God, am I doing well? And then you're thinking about your hands and where to put them. 
I don't know. Wait. Shut up. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Shut, wait, I don't know. wait. I, got I don't a, know. I got a problem. Don't you with think about statement. it? Do you run? No. I no, hate you running. don't run. I hate okay. running. I okay. Do. A I lot do. of people do hate running. Yeah. Do you run? Yeah, I do. Okay. So have you ever thought about like the fact where you're going to put your arms and how you're going to put them? Because like you're doing stuff with your legs and you're yeah. using them as well as you can. Well, e every 10 runs, I sometimes uh, think about how, how my arm movement is impacting my running. For example, oh, I, right. I, yeah, I, used to, I, I know people, you're focusing on the I, performance. I know people who run like who run like this when they like they they hold their arms like this with the elbows out and like yeah. like this, which is which is you're doing yourself. You're not doing yourself. Yeah, you're yeah, running yeah. That way, so you sometimes like the the aerodynamics basically. Yeah, yeah and and um, who the fuck runs with their elbows swinging to the side? There's <laughs> a, dude, I've seen some shit. What the fuck? I've I've seen some like uh, guys running with their arms like like super weird. You know In, what? Yeah, yeah, really. Yeah. You know what's weird to me? What's weird to me is that uh, like running running long distances. Yeah. Well, I, to me to me any distance in running is yeah. is too much. So <laughs> down so to the mall. To, so to me any physical activity, for example, running is is so physically taxing. Yeah, it is. It is. That I I can't even focus on thinking what do I do with my arms? I'm already thinking about I'm exhausted. Yeah. Like, I'm not, I'm like... I'm gonna die. No, that's why a lot of, like, it, it, it is true that it's, like, very energy-consuming to do Unless that. Unless maybe if you're a good runner, right? And, and, and you're My max is 22 kilometers. 22, got you. Yeah. Yeah. That's my max. I just accidentally... Well, not accidentally, yeah. but against... I, I wasn't planning on running, but I, I ran just, like, 21 kilometers. Nice. In, in, in a stadium. Like yeah. Wow, shit, man! Amazing. I I, I, went, I, would I went out die to run then out of boredom. I like decided ah, I can go whole half marathon. <laughs> I had to uh, I had to get on a treadmill, and uh, like, what's the speed on a treadmill? Like six? Uh, they told me to put know. it on six. <laughs> yeah, that's that's, <laughs> that's like that's like, that's, that's, that's like you can like you can you can jog treadmill, you can jog yeah. But so lightly, you you also can you you also can can walk with yeah. this kind of speed on a treadmill. Yeah. And uh, I was given like uh, one kilo dumbbells in each hand, mm. and I uh, and I had to and I had to jog and kind of uh, re not repeat but uh, practice the, the the boxing shots. Yeah. yeah shots? Whatever. Yeah. What are they called? I don't know. Throwing Drill. a punch. No, 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 some what it called the punches, yeah? Yeah. Punches. And you, like, and you, you, you kind of have to jog and do it. Yeah. And you have to do it that for 30 really minutes. Cool. Yeah, it was cool. Nice. I, I thought I'm going to die. <laughs> I didn't. But, well, but that's there's the point a, of the... Like, if you're not sweating, it's not... Well, no, no. Well, I think I, I'm going to die each and uh, <laughs> each day. Like, yeah, but... Uh, it might be my last. The <laughs> that, that, oh, that, oh, okay. That, okay, great thinkers. <laughs> that that, that time of destiny might come. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I was... And I, uh, and I, well, I mean, I started to sweat in like two or three minutes. Yeah. Like it was already as a one. Lot. Yeah. But, and and then in like five or six, I looked at a, I, I, lo I looked at a, a, the, a, the countdown. And I was like twenty five minutes more. <laughs> <laughs> really? That's like whenever I'm, I do. Uh, what are they called? Planks. Yeah. Whenever I plank. Yeah. That's how I feel. Plank I'm, is tougher. I'm like, um, I don't know, two minutes in, and I know that I have to do an extra minute. And I want to die. Yeah, but isn't like two minute planking already a lot? That that's not. Yeah, that, it, it's, it's already a lot, it's, right? It's pretty tough. Like yeah. people, uh, people jog. O on average, for, people can't plank for two minutes. Yeah. No, no. I I remember when I couldn't do uh, forty five seconds. Gotcha, gotcha. And that's just that's like, kind of yeah, you're that's just kind of like <laughs> <laughs> crazy. That's, that's not good. Shit. Yeah, but I couldn't like. It's just, uh, and plus. Plus, I wasn't alone, so there were like the my group mates yeah. who were who were on a on the on the, on the treadmills next yeah. to me, and I was like, <laughs> "That's the worst thing ever." I'm not gonna like this is embarrassing. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, like, because I'm sweating like a pig. I'm three minutes it's, in. I've got 27 minutes left. I'm sweating like a pig. Yeah, and they're just you know You're like a well, cattle, more, like a row of cattle, just running. It on was treadmills. terrible. It was fucking <laughs> terrible. And I was like, I don't have an option of. Mm of calling our coach and being like, 
Yo, man, can I get, can I get off? Like, I, I, I don't. This is my first one since like a, a year pause. I'm like, I don't, I don't. Can those dumbbells you don't be have a little an bit option lighter? Option to quit no. when there are other people who are in your group who exactly. you're gonna see weekly. That's why CrossFit works. Because oh, cro- oh, CrossFit, CrossFit's great. Oh, man, yeah, it's super like, fun. You know what? People should stop. <laughs> People should stop saying CrossFit's that, great. No, no, people should stop saying that CrossFit or uh, well, I respect CrossFit more than just weightlifting. Yeah, but people should stop saying that. Stop saying this, uh, that both CrossFit or weightlifting is a sport. It's not a sport. It's well, not a sport. It's a if you can activity. make it's a physical, it it's a it's a. For example, CrossFit can be a, a, a incredibly tough, mm-hmm. intense physical activity. Mm-hmm. It's not a motherfucking sport. Okay. If you do CrossFit okay. and I sport? ask let's, you, let's let, define yeah, let's sport. define sport is something that Formula is Formula One. Yeah, not not really. No, no. It's just <laughs> it's just it's just rich kids <laughs> driving around, like sp- a sport. That's a, that's in my a opinion, weird opinion. Is something. <laughs> no, that's pretty much it's it. Rich Formula kids One is around. rich kids driving around, uh, and and actually. One of those rich kids' dads. And not dad, competing, just driving. <laughs> right. One of those rich kids' dads uh, recently bought a Formula team for him, basically. There you fucking go. <laughs> kind of kind of proves my point. It's the weirdest <laughs> conclusion ever. No, but here's the thing: like a sport has Drive to be around. both. A sport has to be both physically intense and competitive. Also, comp- I mean, you can compete in, in WODs and there CrossFit. There you go. No, no, no. Not not just competitive. It has to. It has to involve uh, your brain activity. Well, you have to think. Yeah, think of any sports that that is called a game well, on an elite level. You know, you uh, have to do both. Well, listen, any, let's let's make an example. Uh, when I'm running, yeah, I can't like theoretically. I'm just moving my legs, right? But yeah. I'm concentrating on shit. Yeah. Like after the 15 no, kilometer no, mark, like yeah. you're doing stuff. Yeah, to marathon your brain. runners are yeah. sports uh, sports men, sports yeah, women. Exactly. Yeah. And CrossFitters similarly, and weightlifters. I think similarly. No. I don't want to talk about weightlifting because I don't know much about it. It's uh, like it's like CrossFit, but like no, less it, intense. It isn't <laughs> like you don't have to use your brain in late weightlifting because it's, I think it, so. it's a lot about technique. And, yeah, and exactly. That requires thing. thinking. To you, nailing down weightlifting technique is not that difficult. It's not that you mm. no no you pr- you pr- no 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 no. Yeah, but that, doesn't, but that no, doesn't weight, mean that you don't have to think. No, when you when you nail down the technique and you got a program, you, and when you go to the gym, people who go to the gym and when I ask them, yo, what you do? I do sports. Uh, what kind of sports? Gym. That's not sports. I've never heard. Anybody I've say that? Listen, I've, no, <laughs> I've, you, I've, 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 no. What kind no, of sports do you do? People, Dumbbells. There are people who th- exactly. There are people who think that weightlifting. I want to meet these CrossFit people so much. Ain't, CrossFit is not sports either. No, a I've sport, never heard. I, I've never heard anybody call CrossFit a sport. I don't know why are we debating this, but uh, you can. Oh, man. so you think that if you're gonna go to a CrossFit gym, and yeah. you're gonna ask them, "Yo, do you think it's a sport?" and they're gonna be like, "No." No, no, that's not what Cro- I mean. Yeah, CrossFit that's, yeah, but people that's are inc- incredibly arrogant and big-headed yeah, 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 about yeah, yeah, CrossFit. Yeah, but maybe that's not that they want to make CrossFit a sport. They just, they just are not that well versed on it, your definition of sport. Exactly. Well, the fact my, that the you have a definition, definition that the, nobody knows about. The correct definition of <laughs> the sport. Correct the de- correct definition of sport. Doing doing CrossFit is nowhere near as... Uh, <laughs> so no, no, seriously. Doing CrossFit no, is point. nowhere near as uh, playing uh, soccer on an elite level. Okay. Doing CrossFit is... Uh, e- doing elite level CrossFit is mm. nowhere near as playing elite basketball. Doing CrossFit is nowhere near... As uh, being an elite boxer, doing yeah. CrossFit is nowhere but it's weird near doing. To compare them, it's weird. It's just no, I, no. I'm talking about people who yeah. think that if they do these intense physical activities, yeah. that's what they are. Physical activities. They think they're doing <laughs> sports. They're not doing sports because as soon as you nail down the technique and your fucking programs, you apply little to none brain activity. Yeah, yeah. But I think it's more of an issue of branding, like. It's much more convenient to say I do sports than I do physical activities. That's the point. No, no, no but I don't want people. I don't know. I don't want uh, all in all. I, I, I really want to meet these people that call 
like say what do you do sports what kind of sports dumbbells and pull offs yeah like, you uh, go pull-ups. yeah yeah you just you, nobody you, no, you no, nobody nobody that. nobody says i do dumbbells <laughs> like <laughs> no but nobody, i mean nobody says when, when people go to the gym yeah. they say i go to the gym i, I lift yeah, weights they exactly. don't they don't say i do dumbbells <laughs> i mean <laughs> Or, I mean, the thing is that I never heard anybody say anything but I go to the gym or I do CrossFit. It's CrossFit. It's whatever. It's not a sport. It's, exactly. it's not a sport. Exactly. It's not a sport. It's whatever. Not a sport. Yeah. It's CrossFit. I want to ask someone who does CrossFit yeah. without him hearing this conversation <laughs> to tell me is CrossFit they're a sport. They're probably going to call it a sport. They probably will call it a sport. Mm-hmm. And, they're, and, they're, and I'm not judging And them. CrossFitters are incredibly proud of doing CrossFit. It, this is what That's, this that's is the what point that I'm me. really uh, confused about. Everybody that is good at anything is proud that they are doing it. Being good at CrossFit is not that difficult. I mean, are you good at CrossFit? I'm not doing CrossFit. There you go. <laughs> Let me go. No, 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 no. In a, no, I'm, no. In a year... <laughs> If yeah, I'll yeah, no, yeah, no if okay. I'll if I no if I if I'll start doing it in a yeah. year I'll be good at CrossFit. Anyone oh, will. And it will anyone will. Guess what? What I'm not what what I'm not gonna be good at in a year? Basketball, soccer, boxing, tennis, whatever real sport that you yeah. have to uh, that you that you have to practice on much more that you ha- that that involves no, no, that's fine, that's that fine. involves much more pressure mm-hmm. that involves much more brain activity mm-hmm. okay crossfit and gym does not involve fucking brain activity <laughs> like the way the way i'm g- everything kind of does though I, oh, well, if like, you, I, well if you have I, to I well well if you think that moving your fucking legs and arms is brain activity you're right on the concept yes you're right everything but come on yeah all in all I don't really care. I'm just happy that people work out. Yeah, no, sure. Yeah, uh, no, great. working out is great. Fine. Just, yeah. Yeah. Do you think? I'm not. I'm running not a, grass with a ball or lift weights. I, I don't care. No, no, no I'm not. I'm not Whatever saying it's a Whatever prolongs bad thing. your life and doesn't make you fat. Does weightlifting prolong your life though? I don't know, man. With steroids and shit. If you actually, if you actually, no, okay, no, no, not, wait not, a not the not the amateur weightlifting. But no, you no, actually, like you actually do want to go, go professional with weightlifting. I, re- I really don't life? know much about weightlifting. Is it healthy? Lifting. It's not that healthy. Does everything you no professional do sports also fuck you your up? Yeah, body's wishes yeah. prolong your life. But does it prolong your life? I don't know. Or it just shortens probably it? Not, probably not. Soccer just players keep, die on as the long as as long as ballet kills people really early. Everything in moderation, you know. Like don't like we're not talking about prof. I'm not talking about How professional. How come soccer prolongs your life? Though? No, I said it that doesn't. it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't. It Probably doesn't. What, what I mean is that people die on soccer fields. Doing competitive Seriously, sport. that's not a joke. Yep, yeah, that, that, that's There's doing this professional sports is n- none yeah. of those uh, prolong your life because that's usually taking your body past its, yeah, its but threshold. The thing that I said threshold. was not uh, doing sports, but doing physical activities, mm-hmm. as in running yeah. in the well, grass. In that well, here's the, right now. well here's the thing. Activity. Here's the thing. Uh, if you want to do physical activities, stick to gym and CrossFit. <laughs> like, if you want to involve your brain, yeah, that's that. Then it's a real sport. Okay, I get you. Like, if you if you it's go just to weird the, if you go to the gym, yeah. and in between sets or reps, sets reps, reps is reps, whatever the fuck, okay. sets or reps. You can you can have a cup of coffee because that is possible. That is yeah. entirely possible. Yeah. That you can have a cup of coffee in the gym in between your sets. A couple of sips at least. Yeah. Your point being? While uh being on a tennis court and playing or being on a you can on a soccer do field. hockey and drink coffee. No, at you, the same yeah, time. no you cannot. You could. No, you cannot. You, no, you could you cannot. try. That you could stop it. <laughs> there's no, no professional cannot. hockey. No, you cannot. There's no professional hockey. No, you cannot uh, stop it. It's just it's ridiculous. Tournament. It's ridiculous. <laughs> it's fucking ridiculous. You can. I would love to watch that. Like a team against another team. They have like the the puck and whatever, and the the rules are the same. They're just drinking coffee on the way. Fucking pay money for that shit. Uh, yeah, let's uh, let's just go to the next <laughs> topic. <laughs> what uh? What else is up? What's, uh, what's up with you, man? What's up with you? I don't know. Nothing much. Uh, listen to the la- like to the newest Denzel thing, Denzel Curry. Okay, thing. sound off. I, I don't know. I, I liked it. <laughs> I don't know. I liked it. I liked it. It's groovy. It's nice. It, I was moving. 
I was grooving. It's is is a little bit too uh, trappy. No, no, trappy is fine. Uh, yeah. Too much uh, shouting. Oh no, bit. I love that. I yeah, love you that. like it. Yeah, yeah. I just kind of think that uh, if they like shouting and aggression is fine. Yeah, the song sounds nice, but I just with Denzel Curry, I always had a feeling that that's the main reason he's on the mic because he's shouting out the lyrics. Just like Suicide Boys. I don't, yeah, suicide. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, suicide boys. Suicide boys are n- not on the level of Denzel Curry. Mm. That's a that's Denzel a, that's a Curry's subject. album is basically my. Uh, let's wait for a Suicide Boys album. Really? Yeah, it's like it's keeping me time. <laughs> well, then you must you must like like Danny Brown some shit. No, no, don't. no, no. You don't know him? No. You don't know Danny no, Brown? No, no. Fucking weird though. Oh my god. No, but it would make sense if you like Denzel Curry, if you like Suicide Boy. I mean, mm-hmm. they're, they're not exactly like Danny Brown's not exactly identical. I mean, but they're fucking similar. Yeah, I mean, uh, I'm rarely in that mood that I want like trappy hardcore shit, but when I am, that's where I'm going. And I love the the fact that Suicide Boys are two brothers. That one of them is like from a punk band, and the other one's like an underground DJ. Yeah, but you can pretty much like you can pretty much apply that. To Denzel Curry too. I mean, he oh. wasn't in a punk band, but yeah. if you ask him, like, what exactly are his influences? Mm. He's probably gonna probably. say some punk rock yeah. bands or some shit like but that. But that the fact and Tech Nine, yeah, and Tech Nine. I'm yeah. not a. I don't know. It's like whatever. I think the face paint comes from Tech Nine. Oh, he okay. likes to paint his face yeah. a lot. What's up with that? So <sighs> my mom know. doesn't let me do face tattoos. I Got think a face it's like, my a, paint. like having like having f- face paint in yeah. hip hop. As an artist, it's I'm like the it's I'm like not the, it's like it. the pussy version what, what, of. What, what do you mean by face, face paint? Pa- they like he usually paint performs. Paint or makeup? No, they, paint. It's like a tribal. Yeah, like a tribal you thing. Like think of? kind of thing. Hmm? Like, no, more like a tribal. No, not makeup. Not makeup. No, 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 not like makeup. A, what, well, like well, I wouldn't call kiss a, kiss attire a makeup. It's like <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Well, kiss well, attire kiss is something uh, similar to what similar, Tech Nine does yeah. and Denzel Curry. Well, Denzel Curry, he looks like a guy that got painted with a brush like super quickly. Like, Dude, <laughs> he looks like the black uh, the black version of the It Clown. <laughs> God damn it! No, it's not. It's not like. <laughs> because well, because he did imply to do that. I mean, yeah. maybe not the the it clown specifically, yeah. but he did have this creepy clown uh, face paint, the, yeah. the most recent one. So uh, face paint in hip hop is like I the pussy version of face tats. Yeah, it's like you're not ready to commit yeah. to having a face paint. But you want some shit on your face. Yeah, you so. want some shit on your face, <laughs> but you want to take it off after you get off the fucking stage. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, but um. All in all, but you must like the first disc, right, of the album, the first part. I'm not a f- like it's fine. I'm not a. F- I'm not a f- really. I'm not really. A f- no, no, no. I'm, you're, I'm s- you're saying you you don't like the shouting and the whatever, right? Yeah. So that means you must like the, the first more half. the more mild first half. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Here's the thing, I do like more mild shit. Yeah. But I got other artists to provide me with more mild shit. For example, Amine. Okay, but uh, I don't know. I think it's cool. I think no, 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 I'm not. I'm definitely not saying that. Like Denzel Curry's whack or some shit like that. Yeah, I, I'm I not mean, that. I, I actually genuinely think that the first part of the album is actually pretty good, and the I'm, fact I'm that it's coming from that. No, I don't know if I'm rating it higher because it's coming from Denzel, but maybe. Like, if it would come from another artist, like, would I rate it lower? I don't know. It's weird to think about that. But I think that since I'm uh, I'm relating Denzel to like more the other half of the album, and yeah. he comes out with the first half, and I'm like, whoa, man, that's another yeah. side to you. So maybe that's why I'm rating it higher. Maybe, 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 maybe. Because yeah, innovation is cool. Like any artist, the three whenever, beat shit. What? It, it had three sides, no? It it's had three sides. Yeah. Yeah. We're. Just, I'm just putting it like in in the middle, more or less. Because yeah, even the first side gets uh, a little bit aggressive with the sumo it gets a little bit pumpy yeah yeah because yeah. sumo no, ain't chill no, no there's no way no no no, no, no. no but uh yeah i don't i don't know it's yeah. just uh something wrong with the with the video no, no i'm just checking okay all just, right uh being uh on the on top of your uh production skills yeah. so what's the last thing you listen l- l- to l- look how i arranged the mics today 
Like, was the it's pretty <laughs> gas, isn't it? Hell <laughs> was yeah. the was the last thing I listened to? Yeah. Like what what's what's <laughs> was the last? Oh well, I'm an A one point five. I didn't really promote the album, but uh, Eminem is great. Eminem okay. is the shit. He's like the more mild version of Denzel Curry. Okay. Okay. He's like uh, more like not pop, more poppy though. Mm -hmm. He's he, he had a big he had a big breakout single like in 2016, which was Caroline. Eminem is really fucking good. Uh, but um, yeah, I've listened. I've uh, uh, I've listened a lot of his new shit. This 1.5. Yeah. For the for the past couple of days, but I can't get my mind off uh, the, the the Queen. Oh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think the the drama she's making is bigger than the album. That's why she has to make the drama. Yeah, apparently. I guess so. Maybe. Yeah. Well, that her point about Spotify and about Drake, I get that. I don't give a shit. Okay. It doesn't matter. Let's yeah. No, no, we it don't doesn't, care. No, no, it doesn't matter because if if you if you're not underground artist, yeah, or not underground, up and coming, yeah. And Is she uh, up and coming? No, no, no. Okay, that's the point. Okay. she's not. So yeah. she's not allowed to complain about Drake's Spotify placements. Yeah, like, but Drake's Spotify placements were fucking violent. Drake man. would be streamed. Drake would be streamed no, just as much. No, but the thing it's that a, it's a mar do you really Drake would be streamed just mm -hmm. as much without all of those sp Spotify placements. Still, like, still, like, it's just still, I I it's totally Drake, agree. But still, it, no. But Why, if you're Nicki, no, if you're yeah. Nicki Minaj, you're not allowed to complain. Yeah, if you're you, you're in this, you're in the same mainstream space. As Drake, not true, true. Uh, not even same, even more. You have songs with Ariana Grande. Does even Drake does not have songs with Ariana Grande? True, true. Like you have, and she had a single. She had a bed, which was single with Ariana Grande of Queen album, which is not very good. You you're in the you're even more mainstream. Like you, she's doing features with everybody. She's she did that I mean, song with uh, with a colorful teeth man. What is his name? Takashi Six Nine. Yeah, there you go. Colorful it's teeth. It's a cool. Man. It's a cool song. <laughs> it's a cool song. I like it. Really? It's fine. The video is just. I mean, <laughs> I I'm shit. looking at it and my eyes are literally popping out. I can't just. Who gives a shit about the okay. video? No, no. What, what, what do you think about? It? I Tell I me. think that when I lit when I see Takashi's his videos yeah. and then all of a sudden I see that video yeah. I'm just blown away I'm just I mean like, obviously what they're gonna like switch it up because it's Nicki Minaj on the album he's playing there and he's and, and she's acting like his mom it's super weird man. like a, 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 a very in, uh, incestful relationship yeah. of a fucking, son and mom we fucking ground that child for that I hair. like 6 9 What did she like 6 9 I don't know. It's aggressive you would think I would like him because it's aggressive that's, what, that's exactly what yeah. I wanted to say nah why? Because, Maybe uh, if I'm because drunk. of color, her ha colorful hair? hair. I don't know. His image just yeah. He's a he isn't he's a he's like he's super ghetto, right? He ain't the rich or I mean you never not fucking super no, ghetto, no 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 he he is like I think he's I think more from the hood. Say, than, I think yeah. yeah yeah I think saying super ghetto would could be perceived as uh, a little bit racially insensitive. Oh really? Oh no, shit! I'm not That's blaming not you. I mean. I'm just saying like yeah. in general. I'm just All right. speculating. But uh, when it comes to Six Nine, it's like I I don't like he. Some of his songs are not they're I'll they're fine. Like yeah. they're not they're not they're bangers. You know? They're bangers. Yeah, and I like bangers. Like there's yeah, nothing like wrong with bangers. Like if it's on in a in a mall while yeah. I'm shopping for groceries, yeah. I'm gonna move. And plus, like he's extremely charismatic. Like yeah, he's you, super everybody more or less that knows music yeah has heard or seen yeah. him yeah and since you've seen him you're gonna remember yeah. him because there ain't nobody yeah he's not one of the facial tattoo uh, dreadlock dudes he's the colorful teeth man yeah but he does have tattoos on yeah, his face but also a rainbow haircut and not like uh Wait, I don't what is I've, this little pump yeah Lil not pump. like little pump. He has like actual flowy hair, like he's a fucking princess. Who six nine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you see, it's not like the part of the uh, the the part of his image, which is this this extremely colorful colorful visual shit. Mm. That's one thing. But he's actually interesting to listen to. Yeah, yeah. He's at when he when he when he has interviews. He's not even oh, considering. Weird. No, seriously, he's 
It, I've he, heard some. He's ex- yeah. Because the first time that I saw the, him, the, probably the Breakfast Club interview. That's what you saw because it was the most watched Breakfast Club interview okay. of all time. Okay. Which it, w- you, they got like on on YouTube, they got like fourteen, thirteen million, mm-hmm. something like that. In and quick, mm-hmm. and he, and that's what I, why I like him. He's not like he's not stupid. He know he knows how to play the social media game. Mm-hmm. He knows when to make fun of himself, and he doesn't take himself too seriously. And he's super, like, even considering, if you heard his interviews, he has a very, uh, he uh, he cannot form I mean, these, you know, long, concise sentences. <laughs> not because he's stupid, it's just like, well, I don't know, the, he's not, he didn't grow up in that kind of environment. Yeah, it's understandable. Yeah, yeah. Mm. But even, like, he, he, even, he says a lot of, like, he says two, three words, like, then boom. And yeah. Like, so we're doing this, boom, boom. And you would think that it's gonna it's gonna wear out in like fucking five minutes. You're gonna no. get bored. And no, he's, a, he's like he has this some sort of a charisma that just he and he's storytelling specifically. And when he talks, mm. he's not stupid at all. No. Like he's not stu- little pump, though. Lil Pump, oh I've see, there was this whole bridging the gap between the old heads and the mm-hmm. uh, the, the the young motherfuckers, which was uh, J. Cole had an interview with Lil Pump. Really? Yeah. I want to mm-hmm. see that. Yeah. Shit was boring as hell. Oh. You know why? Because Lil Pump can barely put together three <laughs> fucking words. And and uh, in, in comparison to Six Nine, where, where, where he... He kind of navigates of how he talks. Yeah. And he makes it ex- yeah. en- entertaining and interesting. Lil Pump is He's a kid, dull. Man. Uh, I don't give a fuck. Okay, like you be a little a little bit more articulate. For fuck's mm-hmm. sake! Or if no, I mean you don't have to be. So your song, your songs are still bangers. They're still mm-hmm. fire. Mm-hmm. But the interview was dull as okay. fuck. Even considering that Jake Hall was. Conducting, you know, yeah. we're having like this conversation, this uh, yeah, this, yeah. Uh, this um, informal conversation. It was like Lil, Lil Pump is nowhere near the the level of charisma and just this. I don't know. Yeah, I, I the only th- reason why I compare them was because they have colorful hair. Yeah, and, and face that. And face that, yeah. Yeah, but six nine is a different level. Yeah, these are is like agree. a real entertainer. Yeah. He's, yeah. he's, he he got what it takes to mm. entertain people. Lil Pump? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Okay. I don't know. Okay. Lil Pump is like a... Mm, I don't what do you think about face tattoos? Do you like that? Because I, I recently I saw a kid on yeah. the street. Here? Yeah. In Latvia? Yeah. With a face tattoo? Yeah. But, a, but one. Uh, a yeah. One face like the, 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 the... On the uh, drip... The teardrop? Yeah. The teardrop? No, no, on the same place. Like, but what, what, what was I there? Remember, Dime, probably, a, probably Dime, a teardrop. No, 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 it was something more. It like was his hamster died some I, shit. I, I, I a know. lot more meaningful than than the teardrop. Probably. I mean, I saw that, and and then I started thinking, and then I came home and started googling and shit, and it's very, very a much a thing. Like, it's a trend. Yeah, and it's getting to a place that so many famous people or singers or rappers or whatever are doing it that it's becoming a trend amongst people. That's always been like that. Yeah, yeah, but it's a little bit more serious than I don't know rocking a new pair of Nikes because you you can't take it off. Yeah, really. it's, it's on your face, and Isn't I don't have anything yeah. against like augmentation. I have tattoos myself, and but on the whatever. face is a little bit extreme. I don't. I don't. My, I don't weird. give a shit. To me, like, it seems weird. It's not like. like the, I mean, the thing is that I don't it. really care because it's a tattoo is a private thing. If you want to do it, do it. Whatever you want. Yeah. That's not my business. Yeah. If you can uh, continuously get a job and pay your rent and yeah, provide absolutely. for your family with a face tattoo, absolutely. I'm glad for that. Yeah. But uh, the thing is that that they influence too much. <laughs> yeah. Youth? Yeah. I don't because like. What, at that point, it's not a con. I think it's less of a conscious choice at that point. Yeah, because you get in, you, well, exactly. you get influenced. Yeah, and yeah, you think yeah. It's, it's like okay it, it's a trend. It's just you go to H H&M and M, and then you buy the if, thing. Yeah, but I mean, if uh, how well, if you're really young, mm-hmm. you're just a kid. Yeah, like yeah. You th- four, you're gonna get I don't influenced. Know, you, that's you, fine. That's fine. Mm-hmm. But if you're like 14, right, mm-hmm. and you get and you want to get a face that because you get influenced, yeah. but all by all of these artists that you're listening to. Yeah. Where the fuck your parents at? (laughs) 
No, because they have to tell you. Yeah, Listen, yeah definitely. No, no, we don't want to like we don't want to break your wings of creativity mm, and yeah. inspiration. But that's not. But no. maybe just. Just let's chill with those. Yo, yeah, let's chill with those for now. Mm-hmm. If you're gonna figure out how to tattoo. be a someone and and afford yeah. a face tattoo, mm-hmm. rock out with your yeah, exactly. Even if you're a girl, and yeah, maybe yeah, yeah. you have an imaginary. Deck. But, I don't know, but yeah. <laughs> but you do it if you want to. Mm-hmm. But only when you kind of. But if you're 18 and over and you still get influenced, mm-hmm. I mean, people over 18 get influenced yeah. by hip hop mm-hmm. incredibly. If you want to get a face tattoo, yeah, fucking get it. It's yeah, gonna yeah. be it's gonna be both your uh, your amazing experience and it's gonna be both your There's responsibility. Amazing experience about well, getting a face tattoo. Yeah, I get I, it. I, I, I'm pretty much sure that it hurts like hell. Yeah, but ain't nobody loving getting tattoos. Fuck all the people that say, "Oh, I enjoy getting tattoos." No. No, you don't. Because if you do, then I'm gonna continuously punch you in the face because you apparently enjoy pain. Yeah. Fuck that. Well, maybe some people enjoy pain. It's, well, actually, but it, 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 I know it, it's it, a thing. It, it that really depends because I also kind of enjoy that. That <laughs> depend. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm talking about not like a thirty minute session. Yeah, I'm talking exactly. about a three hour session. Exactly. I was uh, I was having a tattoo on my leg. Yeah. Which is a really big portrait. Yeah. And first hour and a half was yeah. chill. And then shading. And then for three extra hours i was dripping sweat yep i was th- there was a whole silhouette underneath me uh, of after sweat, the yeah. session of sweat i was i i want i wanted to, it to stop really badly even like two hours for me is yeah i don't know after two hours the first hour is always like whatever yeah but the second hour always just like come on can we can we just like skip maybe like uh tomorrow maybe let's let's continue tomorrow i know we stop it's fine it's <laughs> i know especially this. when they start to like uh shade it yeah, yeah. Stuff shading like that. is like just kill yourself it's, it's just it's no. just let's let's leave it like that it's pretty fine yeah because like one needle wasn't good enough let's do 16 yeah uh, Never I, got a tad done. Yeah, and, and then apply some white paint, which uh, uh, apparently hurts yeah. the most. White paint is just like, hey, let's put some highlights. No, let's not put any highlights. No, I it, know th- it hurts that much. Don't you? Don't you? Get, uh, aren't you able to get like some painkillers and shit, or they don't help? You could, you could. I think I've, I've heard of people, yeah. some people who got tattoos. They were doing that shit on painkillers, like on yeah, a, on a, on extremely. Uh, Intense, not intense, but uh, strong painkillers. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. know. You, I, I you wouldn't do anything. I wouldn't do that. There's, well, so, there's that's something what I'm about Why don't the you, if, if the pain is so extreme. No, no. no. I mean, there's something that one about time, the pain and the accomplishment when you're done. There's something about that. Oh, I'm so it's just this re- and, and, and this reward yeah, feeling yeah, yeah, in your y- brain. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. also, you don't want to be drugged the hell up for the whole but fucking not, day. When, when oh, I'm, well, I'm going to yeah, go do a like, two-hour tattoo, the, and then I would have to, like, use, I don't know, fucking hair. Well, treat, it, no, well, treat it like a surgery, you know? When, on, in days surgery, you got no, nothing planned. I guess. You, but I could... You pop painkillers, you go do your tattoo, yeah, it's a fucking weekend, then do, you fuck off. go and do my sports at gym afterwards. <laughs> no, you don't have to do... Listen, you can skip... <laughs> <laughs> Great callback. Great, yeah. Yeah. No, I don't know, like, well, just... the thing is that uh, while I was looking up like young people and face tattoos and what and whatnot, I got on the rabbit hole of uh, augmentations and so on, as uh, as you call piercings and so. Oh, the, like yeah. The scarring shit? No. No, no, no. The thing that I got into was or found out is that in Moscow now there are like tattoo shops that also color your eyes. Like oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's been I, yeah, I've yeah. Been about it. yeah, it's been, been it's been a while. Yeah, like it's not I just it's not just Russia. It's been like that. And yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, but do you know the fact that there's it's not discussed of is it gonna do something or is it not gonna do? It something? will do. It's right? definitely yeah, gonna do. It's definitely gonna do something. But like, ain't no like it's like vaping. You know, it's like it's better, but we don't know why. <laughs> it's better than what? <laughs> than smoking. No, 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 vaping might eye be. Is no, better but eye No, but eye tattooing is better than what? No, no. Uh, Not having <laughs> eye tattoos? What no, the fuck? The, the fact that you can't, uh, we don't know everything about it. Like, yeah. what is it going to cause? When is it going to cause it? Yeah. How it's going to cause it? Is it going to be internal? Is you it going to be yeah, external? Yeah, you know? and you know, when you get like, uh, when you get laser for your eyes? Yeah. Same shit. They don't, they still don't know how it affects people. Okay, okay. Because they're like, when, when this shit started, 
the like the laser surgeries mm-hmm. those people the first people who got them still had there was like 10 years ago yeah 10 15 10 12 15 those people still haven't aged they don't know what happens mm-hmm. with the, the the developments of progresses afterwards when yeah. you age i guess so you have to if you want to get an eye tattoo out. it's your <laughs> it's your fucking like like people are allowed to do whatever they, f- yeah. whatever the fuck they want. Also, do, the things as long as it your involves skin. their, f- do it. Yeah, I mean, to me, like to you, obviously, you you sound like it's fucked up to you. No, no, it's but just, you sound like that. You're I, like, wow, know, this is like interesting. this is extreme. No, no, it's just not interesting. Not fucked up it, in a bad way, but like unfathomable. No, I mean, it's new. Just new fucking tattoos in your eyes. It's just new. <laughs> yeah, I mean. Because I, I have know. piercings and plugs and and gauges and shit and plugs, eye tattoos, eye tattoos. <laughs> I, I tattoos. That, that that's a, I think to my mind it, it's an overkill. Because yeah, but you can get a lens, get lenses yeah, and but, shit, but and but it, you, they look as authentic. It might be an overkill. And they, even, they even look better. That's the same as saying like, ten years ago, instead of a tattoo, you can get a sticker. No, it's it's totally not. Or the not same. the sticker, like it's, the, the, the chewing gum shit. The yeah, that, that's yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. But th- that's exactly not the same. <laughs> but yeah, of course, it's you, not the same. No, but the but thing if is you want to get a, like, if you want to get an eye tattoo, yeah, just get a fucking eye tattoo. What I would what I would want for people to have is information. It's like if you want to get an eye tattoo, exactly. That's the only thing. Have in like people not only have information and mm-hmm. you know seek for information, but also. The people who provide you, for example, yeah, with like eye tattoos, pamphlet, you know, they need to they, they need they need to <laughs> provide you before your eye tattoo. <laughs> exactly. They need to provide you with relevant information of what are the risks and you, exactly. so on and so forth. That's and like then you make the decision buying, because it's still your body. Yeah, that's like me going to a restaurant, buying a plate of food, and knowing what's in the plate of food. Yeah, I love descriptions, man. Well, then again, in, rest- in restaurants, in you never eye. fucking know. You, they tell you one thing. It's yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's true. But the, what was the worst you could get? A food poisoning? It's fine. Eye yeah. tattoos, you can lose your sight. No, there's that There's that restaurant Probably. with that fish that you can eat and die. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, fugu fish. Yeah, fugu, fugu fish. Yeah but, as, yeah, but it's expensive. And guess what happens when, when shit is expensive and you buy it? They kind of service you to it and they <laughs> give you information. Yeah, it's even more luxury because yeah. you can die. Yeah. It's yeah. stupid. I don't think it's like the thing is that that there are a lot of things there are a lot of things that are stupid to you or to you but mm. if people want to do it like I like you can find shit that is that to you is completely stupid no no it's but not if stupid it I'm only just, affects yeah. the, like you know what is stupid and that, like is universally stupid if for example you want to you want to your lifestyle involves extreme littering on the street, for example you want to shit on the street yeah but if you want to shit on the street yeah and I find it stupid. I'm allowed to tell you that you're not allowed to shit on the street because it, in, it doesn't involve just you. Oh, the street that's is public. Mm-hmm. So if if you want to do something mm-hmm. and which is might be extreme to me, mm-hmm. that you're allowed to do it in the confinements of whatever your pro- spaces and properties are, yeah. including yeah. your body. Mm-hmm. You can do whatever the fuck you want with your yeah. body, and along the way, you're gonna deal with whatever comes with having a face tat or something fair enough fair but enough. if you want to have a face tat like i don't know i don't think i don't think kids should have face tats because it's just it's a risk of of not of like you probably like listen if you like if you're a 15 year old like you're a parent and you have a 15 year old and you want to and your 15 year old want to get a face tat uh book him a studio session Make sure that motherfucker can rap if it sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> because if, if it, he can he can mumble on some beats. Yeah, <laughs> if that shit it sounds good, it's like yeah. I right, uh, you might have a career yeah. in this. You might have get a, that uh, teardrop. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> or, or, yeah, or, who died? Who died? Grandma. Okay, okay. Fine. Or, or, or strike him down. You can't even mumble, motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Then get a face tat. But uh, yeah, if I don't like it. But if you're 18 and over. And you get influenced by hip hop, get a motherfucking face. Hey, tat. do you know anything about Brokehampton? Of I mean, course. No, I mean about new shit. Yeah. When is it coming? I'm, yeah, well, I'm excited. here's the problem. About Can we Broke have Hampton? it? Can we just like no, give no, uh, it? the Please, problem? I wanna. Did you did you listen to the did you listen to the latest singles? Yeah, all of them, all of them. Yeah, they're not as good. Ah, uh, they're not as good. 
Some of them are like not, the one, the quick one, the really short one, the last one. It, it Diana. was fine. It was. I uh, like the last one, the third one. I think it was Diana. Yeah, the wildfires were the first. Wildfire, wildfires, Truman, Truman Diana. Diana. Diana was okay. Truman and wildfires are not that great. I think it's the opposite. I think wildfire and Truman are better, and Diana is really boring. I, I don't know, but mm -hmm. I but I but I know one thing. One thing is that it's a it's a, a peculiar correlation between uh, Amir Van, mm -hmm. the arguably best rapper in the group. No. Amir is the Amir is our is need, the best. I need I need phones with names. Um, Amir Van is the best is the best was the best well, rapper. Was who is the best rapper in the world? No, 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 in no, no, no. Brockhampton. Brockhampton is this amazing fucking band. Okay. I mean, one year, three albums. Yeah. Oh, saturation saturation series were fire. Those, I mean, those I still were, put it on. Yeah. What what, what kind yeah. of band? Uh, it's a Brockhampton. It's like a collective. It, they're like the new. They call themselves the New Age pop, uh, uh, a boy band. It's a collective of people who are both uh, s singers, rappers, uh, just creatives, Producers, fucking graphic whatever. designers, yeah, yeah, yeah. so on and so forth. And they put. Uh, they probably put out like one of the best albums of 2017. Yeah. And yeah. they put out three albums, three full length albums, not while living fast. all in one house yeah, and they, producing there and recording they there. They met. They met at, at uh, Kanye to the forum. Yeah. They yeah. all met like on the internet. They all kind of connected, just chatting up, mm -hmm. and they moved to this one house in L.A. and started doing music. Well, they well their leading guy Kevin Abstract, mm -hmm. which is like the most famous one. Mm -hmm. He was, uh, I mean, I, it, you, you kind of have to take into account that, uh, that Kevin Abstract kind of propelled them to more yeah, publicity. Yeah, he was, he was the leader, dude. Yeah, he still yeah. is. Yeah. But Amir Van was, to me, the best rapper in the group. Okay. You know, he exited the group, right? Yeah, I they know, I know, him I know, out I know, I know, I know. Because of, uh, because of sexual assault allegations? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, uh, and right after that happened they were uh, before before the before the sexual assault scandal they were supposed to put out uh their fourth album it was supposed to come out in june or something really yes puppy puppy was supposed to was puppy yeah, that's was supposed what to I read come out and in I, june yeah a, a, afterwards the, that i cuz i'm looking up like i really want that album yeah. and uh but i missed that point at all mm -hmm. on the news or social yeah. medias and whatever and i since it didn't happen i thought uh, maybe it's just a rumor no, no, shit started flying because they they signed a huge uh, they signed a huge record deal with uh, with RCA. What were the with the record label? Yeah, uh, like with well, there it's a lot of people in the group, but like a huge amount of money. So they kind of went completely mainstream, like in terms of success. Oh yeah, definitely. And they were supposed to put out uh, their fourth album, which which was supposed to be Puppy, which was supposed to come out in June, mm -hmm. and. Shit started popping off and flying and everything is great. And suddenly in the motherfucking Me Too era, this one guy who was even even if you don't consider him the best, Amir Van yeah. was an integral part. What's, who's your favorite? Who's your favorite? I got a couple. No one. I got choose no, one. one. I can't choose one. I'm sorry. Just no like, way. No. No. I like Kevin what? Abstract. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I like Matt Champion. Yeah. That's my favorite. And yeah, Matt Champion's mm -hmm. fire. I liked very much Amir Van, and mm -hmm. I like Bareface. Okay. Bareface has Bareface is Bareface is the guy that they put on for R and B ish but ballads. Uh, remember Team? Okay. Bareface. Oh, okay. The guitar guy. Yeah. The white one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bareface is fire too. So, um, so everything started going on great, mm -hmm. and suddenly the Me Too era, and uh, one of. Amir Van was instrument was important. It's very interesting that now if you Google for Brockhampton and then you find the the list of members, There's Amir all... is the first one. Yeah, well maybe because of the alphabet. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, yeah, Amir uh, Amir Van was in, uh, instrumental to the group. Yeah, yeah, definitely. He's iconic. It's yes, in, yeah. it's, it's specifically in the heavy hip hop songs. Yeah. Yeah, Come on. definitely. Yeah, I do love him. That's not what I'm okay, saying. Okay, maybe he's just not my favorite. And fine, I, and that's I fair. Think, that's and fair. I think that Don that's is fair. the most lyrically diverse and yeah, better maybe. as a as a lyrical rapper. But Amir person. was like this gangster rapper. 
He had this, like, he, he had this... Lyrically, just, yeah. just rhyming in a nutshell Fair enough. better. Yeah. Fair enough. But I just, but a huge letdown to me is that they they booted him out of the group because of the sexual assault allegations. Yeah. And it wasn't even rape. Yeah. It was like, he was too rough. Like, it's just, they had sex and he was too rough, some shit like that. Well, what I don't know the details. Yeah. The thing is that they booted him the him out of the group mm-hmm. and they the puppy got canceled. Uh, the also tour, tour got postponed. Yeah. And they started, and they have this huge super mainstream Beats radio show. Mm. And I'm pretty sure they were booked for, which show was that? When they, the first song, the first I single know, that they I know, it was on the Late Night Show. Late Night Show, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It was, it, that's, that's the, uh, t- I, the Tonya, the I, Tonya yeah, song. I, Tonya. That's not so, out, and it sounded amazing. Yeah, I didn't like it. Uh <laughs> I'm sorry. I was really bored, but I want to hear the studio version. That's the point. Yeah. If I'm going to hear the studio, maybe I'm going to change my mind. But I have a feeling yeah. that because Amir is not in the group, yeah, it's just they're going to struggle a little bit. A little bit. They yeah. might. That's, because the, but these that's three normal. songs that they but yeah. these three songs that they put out, yeah. Maybe maybe because Dude, I'm they, because their albums I'm, yeah. last year's albums are too good. Amir was in Amir was on even on the fucking on all of the three album um covers. Covers. Yeah, that's true. That's very true. Amir is fire. Yeah, that's not what I'm saying. You know, you know what was the funniest thing? You ever thought why it's saturation? Yeah, because they're oversaturating the year with the music. No. Why not? No. I like that no. idea. Don't take no. my idea. No. I would tell you, I have, listen. Is it true you, you know, or is it a, sports No, already, I don't know, but I have, I have this. That's enough. For no, 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 you wait. have a theory. I have a theory. Th- no, 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 wait. No. I have a theory that when you're going to hear this, it's going to sound much fucking better. Okay. Than your shit. Go ahead. My uh, shit. Humble, when, you know humble, when, you know when, uh, you know, no, 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 listen, brag. listen, listen, saturation. So okay. think of this, of the saturation covers. Yeah. It's all three Amir. Can I put on the cover? Yes. Put any cover of saturation, please. Saturation, Brockhampton. So, so Can while uh, while Richard is putting it? up the, fu- uh, the 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 motherfucking shit of uh, uh, like this, yeah, yeah, just yeah, you're gonna yeah. find it. Don't worry. It's just yeah, together. here, That's fine. It. Uh, put whatever the yellow one. This? Yeah, the one, the, the the yeah. This that's a mere van. So here's the thing. That's the third one, right? Yeah, saturation yeah. three. Okay. It's not gonna be. Uh, it's not gonna. It's not gonna be racist. However, you know when you put when you uh, when you take a picture, for example, on Instagram of your face and you're a white person, right? Okay. Hear yeah. me out. Hear me out. And when you do saturation. And when you do saturation, when you over yeah, when yeah, you yeah. do intense I saturation, you. you become red, in- intensely red. Y- yes. Yeah. That's that's what happens that, with white that's, face. Yes. With the black face, when you oversaturate a black face, it becomes intensely blue. Oh, that's I think is the meaning of saturation. Oh. Did you try it out by painting your face black and then oversaturating no, yourself? No, no, no. But you know what happens? Obviously, uh, you wouldn't know, you? <laughs> you know what happens? You've never seen you. You know, no, no. You, you, you know what happens with black people uh, in the in the sun? It's not a fuck. It's not a raci- <laughs> racially insensitive thing. They probably thing. do not become Be- blue. I- that's the point. They do. Not like this, of course. They, I'm telling you, I swear I to God, I never believed that shit myself be- yeah. before I went to Tenerife and there were um, like... Uh, b- 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 Blue people. Tenerife is extremely this is sunny. This getting weird. No, weird. it's not, you stupid fucks. <laughs> I'm telling you. No, no, I'm not PC. I'm, I'm telling you, black, uh, black people in the sun uh, when Stop they all saying uh, that, <laughs> I don't know why, but it's not I'm a not racial a thing. I'm, I'm not a PC. I'm trying person. to explain. I That's know. my theory. Okay. Here's when you oversaturate a, a yeah. black person's face, it turns blue. Whereas okay. when you oversaturate a white person's face, it turns, turns red. red. Saturation, blue faces yeah. on all three covers. But, but yeah, I, I get that. I get that. Also, uh, there's uh, there's an explanation why their face is blue. What, what, they have what's explained with this that. Blue guy, though. The old, I mean, what do you mean? What's that? What what? What's uh, it's the, the another member. Oh. Another member. There is a bunch How of people. How many album in the group. covers did they have? I, I they had like each the, they had each portrait for the situation yeah. three, but uh, the official one is this one. That's the official the, ones are the Amir ones with the yeah. face the, mask and the he's car. He's in the guy. car. Yeah, that's yeah. the second one, and then the face mask. Yeah. Yeah. 
But uh, basically, I don't remember, but uh, Kevin explained why the faces are blue. Why? I don't remember. <laughs> but it's not your theory either. It's not the, um, no, we're no, oversaturating no, no. the year with albums. Th- th- that doesn't tackle the blue paint thing at all. Listen, whatever Kevin's theory is, mine is much What? fucking better. Okay. Oversaturating. Yeah, yeah, come on, come on, come on. Both theories can coexist. I mean, well, if... No, no, Kevin... No, oh, not Kevin's this one. No, no, di- no, yeah, like this one and yours. Yeah, but also, like, no, no, Kevin said that Kevin Abstract, the leader of the group itself, had uh, oh, their own a, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. official explanation of why the blue face on the album covers. I've never heard it. He forgot about it. But I'm pretty I fucking can, can sure... Can we Google it while he's pissing? Yes, yes, let's do it. Do I? Check it out. How, what do I Google now? Uh, Google uh, Brockhampton saturation Brock cover explanation Ham- or Blueface uh, explanation. Blueface. Sorry. So awkward to type like this. No, no, no problem. Uh, uh, no, it's just the it's just bunch of the it's just bunch of interviews, just bunch Can of. Can someone inter- explain, bro? Saturated. Seemed the third time. Get to know the members. No, it isn't. It's it's it isn't. Well, or maybe I can. Uh, Listen, we Google it. We can't find the official theory of what Kevin Abstract was talking about. Yeah, I, uh, I just thought about it. You uh, no, you just made it up, right? What do you mean? <laughs> you Th- that he had a theory. <laughs> oh no, he had a but theory. We can't, we can't uh, find do, it. How do we Google it? I don't know. Kevin Abstract uh, interview about face paint. Yeah, but we're not going to yeah, go Googler. through a, like a whole interview. Kevin though. Abstract. Album cover explanation. So, oh, so cover oh, revealed. No. Gonna have no. cover track list. It, it, yeah, no, no, we're not like maybe it's just dream open. It. No, like, no, fine, but maybe it's just open nah, for interpretation. Man. Fuck it. It's so, whatever. I think the guys are very. They're up for the fact that everybody's interpreting their albums. Yeah, and I think they're they're trying to make it. They're a little bit tryharding on the controversial side sometimes. No, what do you mean? Well, sometimes when when they're like really artsy fartsy in some kind of way, I think they're giving zero explanation and trying to be a little bit more controversial. It's like with the face paint and the da da da. I no, mean, I don't know. It's a little bit, just a tad, very little. But otherwise, they're all great with their artsy know. fartsy stuff. I like their like the well, Kevin Abstract, the leader of the group, is gay. And uh, they have uh, they they it like the gay themes are very much incorporated in their oh, art. Oh yeah, they had a whole merch line with like a like strap-ons and stuff. Stop being homophobic. <laughs> what strap-ons? What? Do you, why? Why do gay? Why Bro do gay camp? men need strap-ons? Listen, I don't. I don't know. So gay men do not need strap-ons. So, so they're female. You put it on your belly uh, and you have two. They're, they're female fans. fans. You put can, it on your belly like and you have two, so you can bang two. Yep, dude, double and triple penetration. No, no, exactly. you like you put the it shit. on you put it on your forehead, and then you just rock well, it out well, yeah. with your cock out. <laughs> yeah, rock it out. So here's the out. here's the thing. Like they had this whole they like well no they have a bunch being gay is is a lot about dicks so so you can get you can well just that's sell dicks. that's offensive to lesbian gay people no those, those are lesbians I, I prefer, well wait I being pre- gay I, I prefer to divide it in like the, the, the gay like and yeah, lesbian yeah. gays oh, males either, either and you're homosexual and that's universal or you're gay um, gay male gay gay can be females too man yeah I know but but then again why it's just but, I but, really why, don't why care do, about this yeah 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 but but why do lesbians get their own definition like there there isn't a lesbian man and, oh, and that I, is true. i'm a lesbian man what the fuck are you talking about yeah that, that i knew but, <laughs> but, but, but yeah what, what, I, what, I i get what you mean but like do we, yeah this so we me. have no so many titles. maybe women guys. just need a little bit more than men okay can we have like this uh, this can reverse uh, power uh power okay, yeah, dynamic sure. <laughs> no problem no problem <laughs> no here's the thing so What were you They have about? a lot of gay shit. Oh yeah, yeah. A lot of gay shit. And I remember when uh They're just know, very open. I, I don't they're think they're very like they're putting it out there like well, they, it matters. I mean it, no, they're no, very open. No, the, it's it's not just be no, no no, I think they d- also like they do make an effort uh, to make a statement. There's yeah, so like Yeah, but listen, listen. Let's just look at it in a way that 
uh, of course, cancel out the songs, cancel lyrics and whatever. Yeah. Just think about what they're putting on social media. Yeah. All that shit. No, I'm not. Ca- uh, oh, okay, fine. Why? For now. For now. First. First and foremost. Okay, go ahead. The things that they're putting out are not that, like, they're not making an effort. Because if you compare it to another couple, like a heterosexual couple, yeah. they're doing the same shit. If they're famous, they're putting, if they're both famous, they're going to do the same shit on oh, Instagram. Oh, but I'm not, no, no, no. Yeah. I'm not, and no, then no, no, no. The no, that, if I, if I, no, I'm sorry to interrupt you, but if I would be saying that, hey, have you, like, their social media strategy yeah. is, is, is incredibly uh, yeah. pro gay. Or something like that. Mm-hmm. That would just be homophobic. He he can like that's his that's their life. That's yeah. whatever they exactly. put out. I'm talking about specifically art. Yeah. And specifically art, for example, uh, for example, they uh they have explicit even like dick sucking lyrics. Uh, yep. No, no, no. Within the, their if songs. we're getting to the lyrics, no, at no, no that hear me point, out. Yeah, hear me out. Yeah. Yeah. Well, which by the way, just sonically sounds amazing. Mm. Uh, they have a merch line with a uh, with a cap with gay, a sweater gay, socks gay, mm. all that shit. So they do they like the, the, they're very outward, it, mm-hmm. which is which is actually great. Mm-hmm. And what I don't like is uh, for people uh, like I've, you, Alice, one of the people who were on the podcast. She's uh, yeah. in country right now. She told me like. I started listening to Brockhampton uh, mm-hmm. like when they had before saturation they had All American Trash which came yeah. out like 2015 something like that. Yeah. And I was like, "Oh shit, Kevin Nash because I like Kevin Nash mm-hmm. right? Brockhampton great." So they started putting out saturations. And mm-hmm. I was like, "Oh my fucking god. This is unbelievable." Like yeah. saturate like especially the, like when you just heard the first yeah. one. That was like, "Wow." Yeah. Right? The the uh yeah, I'm mm-hmm. a shit my. I was like, I, I was like, I need to tell everyone now. This yeah, is amazing. Yeah, that's literally what I did. Yeah, for months and months of the 2017. Exactly. So, and I told you're, you're really selling this shit. If, yeah, yeah. If, if it isn't any good, I'm gonna. Call no, you this out is no, no, no. It's There's fire. no fire. It's it's, f- it's it's on, and it's so diverse. Yeah, it's like insane. On, oh, it's just unbelievable. Especially how, how, the f- okay. How do you start it? Which which album? Saturation. Just saturation. start with saturation. One, two, one, two three. three. Oh, oh they're yeah. all called the same. saturation. Yeah. One. Yeah, that, hence my great theory. Yeah. But uh, here's the thing. The thing is that uh, what, what what your great theory about how, how, the what saturation does, what does album do covers. <laughs> yeah, but okay. Yeah, H- how come that uh, they how albums one through three explains it better than his theory of the why is it saturation and a blue face on the cover? Because they want to no, be I, different. No, I'm specifically about one, two, three. Because you oh, like, one, two, three is the one part, two part, and three part. There's yeah, no yeah, fucking yeah, theory yeah, behind no. that. Yeah, but why, why three albums and then it's because of. Your theory. No, it's not. No, it, I wasn't talking about that. Oh. I d- didn't imply it like that. Oh. Whatever. But don't get all co- all cocky with me. So here's the thing. Oh. No, no, no. Here's the thing. Uh, when uh, so I told Alice about uh, saturations. Yeah. And I was like, this shit is amazing. And then she heard it, and she was like, yo, this shit is amazing. And yeah. she started telling other uh, people about saturation. Yeah. Some of them people. Uh, some of those people were uh, heterosexual guys. Mm-hmm. Just like guys, and they were like, "Yeah, it sounds good, but uh, the the gay theme <laughs> is not very interesting is, for it, me. Not even like, Thank you, not even no. like interesting, but it's like it kind of like I can't listen to it like that. It just kind of turns me off." I don't understand that. And to you know slightest. what? I don't. I don't. I don't understand why. Uh, and when you like, you don't have to be gay. First of all, sonically, first of all, sonically, the songs sound amazing. Yeah, just sonically, without even the lyrics. It's just the flow What's is the amazing. One, the, the the most controversial one. Mm. Shit, the one with the the the, the heavy ass beat when he was like, "I told my mom I was gay." Why yeah, the fuck yeah, she yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, Mad yeah. Champions about yeah. the uh, yeah, about the rape, but 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 the respect her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That was that shit was amazing. That, that's the one that everybody listened to, and that's the one that got uh, passed around, and that's the one that popularized the gay theme the most. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah, because it made it was, a huge it was, statement. It was it, it was directly explicit. Yeah. like it was super. And the explicit. video and the everything. Oh, so what it. I understand about about straight guys not liking the 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 gay part. Yeah, is that in hip hop, hip hop was always uh, well. First of all, you got even in 2018, mm. you got to be quite fucking brave as a guy in hip hop as a hip hop artist. True, true. To be 
as also explicit. Also, they're a boy band. Yeah, as explicit about your sexuality as yeah. you are. Oh yeah, sure. Like That's extremely. Good. And I don't, and it's, and I don't get the point. It's like you can, you don't have to relate to the lyrics, if you, if you're not gay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But you can relate to the energy of it. Yeah. To, to the energy of like, fuck all of y'all. It is what it is. Like, like I'm, I don't have to like. It, it's literally, it's literally like the energy of 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 uh, of being a rebel. It's the energy yeah. of being what you want. Of not only being what you want to be. That's how she's, but doing what you want to do and telling people get off your dick or also, get on your dick if you're gay. Yeah. So, but yeah. And also the grooves are fucking great and the beats yeah. are insane. Yeah. And this is why I understand if you like the song mm -hmm. sonically and mm -hmm. you're like, yeah, I like it. I could listen to it. But I can't but get the to the political lyrics, side I just can't get it. over them, right? Fuck. That's a homophobia, isn't it? That's it's, homophobia, it's, it's, but it's, 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 it's very close. I, I, I get what is you it, mean. It boggles it, my mind. I don't know. I don't think, I don't think it's, it, it's, uh, I mean, Nobody for a, if a homophobic guy hears the song, he's mm -hmm. going to turn it off. Probably. But I don't think it you, you can not, like it's specifically for a homophobic people. Like I I get that a guy that not a especially in Latvia mm -hmm. not a very um, very uh, like open minded diverse dude who listens to hip hop mm. and goes to fucking hoot shop for his stupid ass clothes. I'm yeah. sorry, uh, it ain't that bad. Uh, this hoot shops not shoes that. though. Now, now I think it's, it's it's getting much better. I don't know. It, I haven't checked them out for like two years. I don't yeah, know. you should because the shoes though. I I had a so podcast with with the guy and shit. He's like our local rapper, Gibbs Rosenthal. Who is oh, that's his shop. Yeah, yeah. 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 But it, two and years he, ago, he is, I, is now no, he's two year, very two years very ago. It was a little bit down the. They had crooks but, and castles and some yeah. But now, it, I mean, it's one of the best uh, shoe selections, yeah. and it's not the same as like Bam Bang or Commune or and uh, and also clothing. Yeah. They're clo he's really like in innovative. Yeah. In right yeah. now. Yeah. Really, what kind of brands they have? They got they have, you know, all they, the, they all make the their custom shit. Uh, they, yeah, that's they, also they get, they get white, like uh, white label uh, stuff. Gotcha, and, then, yeah. and then do these. What he's uh, he told me now that they nowadays he's very focused on his like new shtick is doing popular brand knockoffs. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Or, that's or, very but that's not trendy. that's not his shtick. No, no, that's no, a shtick. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that's yeah. what he does right now. Yeah. yeah. Like, okay. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Fair but enough. the shoe selection, okay. very Fine. good. I haven't checked them yeah, out. Yeah. Maybe I'm wrong. Yeah. Fine. But if, if but it, like the, the gay lyrics can, like, I get that a guy from Latvia who listens to hip hop mm -hmm. and might not be specific, like, particularly homophobic, mm -hmm. he could not yeah, but care less, but he'll be like, I want to relate to the music and the lyrics. So the gay part is not about me. So mm -hmm. it kind of turns me off. But you can relate to the energy of it. It's yeah, and also like there are a lot of songs like "Sweet" that are just banging. Just but, like but, there's uh, nothing. Oh, uh, the gummy, gummy, gummy. Yeah, <sighs> yeah. I, I didn't mean the homophobia part like in a bad way. No, really. no. Yeah. I, I mean, was just because if it bothers you, that that's how you call it. You can't call it other. It just, no, 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 no. Those no, are no. my views. No, those are views. Uh, no, no. But that's what you said. Homophobia. That maybe, mm. maybe they're homophobic. They're just, yeah, yeah. Maybe. But, no, but, but but you can be like very honest and and don't mean it in a you, very yeah. in a cruel or you can or you can also way. You yeah just, absolutely you just, I don't like it it puts me I, off no no that, that's, but that's homophobia that, I think anyway that's what you're saying yeah I, th I think, yeah. So. I think like, so I don't I don't think it, it can be I don't but that's what you said like if you if it turns you off you like the song but the lyrics specifically gay lyrics turn you off you're saying that in you're your homophobic, opinion it's a homopho it's homophobic yeah but not so. not in a bad way what's the definition of homophobic yeah, I don't know. So I think it's the fact that you it makes dislike you uncomfortable. or it makes you uncomfortable. You don't act fine, out on it. Like say yeah. all all gay people are should be deported. Yeah, no, that's I think, already I think extreme. No, I think homophobia Phobia. involves not liking gay people. Yeah, mm, I think, I think uncomfortable just, is not good. I don't enough. think I it's. Think I don't it's think yeah? homophobia. I, I, I phobias are usually usually because. Well, you're you, you're not you're then scared then of again, heights or or you feel uncomfortable when you're high up. No, no. And, 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 what, what I mean is, that I, I get I get I get what you're saying when you, you talk don't about hate the, hates. Yeah, like but as it's such like a, a it's, metric. I hate. Yeah. You're yeah. using homophobia as a technical definition. Yeah, but yeah, if yeah. you but if you use it as a popular definition, okay, a, yeah, then, a person then, who is homophobic is just a person who explicitly does not like gay people. Yeah, I, I yeah. use it very technically. Yeah. It, okay. Yeah, but so. but that's the part I don't like. If you don't like I'm the so song, I'm so surprised you haven't heard any of the songs. Yeah, 
I like, may, I maybe I am because I have definitely seen the covers. Yeah, okay. definitely. Okay. Yeah, but because like they were so they were oversaturated. Beca- yeah. Because yeah. I, I can't I can't <laughs> imagine that they did not appear on my yeah. Spotify. That, that had to be on Spotify. Shit. That's yeah. where I get my music yeah. from. For Spotify discovers usually mm-hmm. and, and very popular. But shit. then again, last year while I was telling people about the albums, I was telling people because they didn't know. So oh, a lot of that, people. That's didn't not hear. a surprise. Yeah, they ca- they they literally came out swinging. Yeah, but at this Just point, like I think since the year passed yeah. and they got settled in with the fucking three albums. I think with sp- like with the Spotify playlist mm-hmm. shit. Yeah, because it's just like you don't have to kind of invest yourself to be like, okay, let me. Let me try to listen. Let me try yeah. to like this group. You're just, just listening like, to Tyler or Earl or yeah. Vince, and you're getting to Brokehampton. You get on a playlist, and you hear at least one of the uh, well, the popular songs of yeah. their album, and you're like, uh, what is this? What is it? What the fuck? Can, uh, you, yeah. can you search your Spotify playlist? I don't have a Spotify. I, don't so. have Spotify I mean, I don't have playlist. a Spotify playlist. You're, you're a title guy? Uh, no, I'm an Apple Music guy. Oh, oh right. oh. wow! Not Ooh. it's not even a stance. It's just it's I, 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 I. No, it's not. I get, <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! I got on Apple Music first, and I was like, "Fuck it, I don't want to yeah, change shit." Nah, nah, I get that fine. Spotify might be yeah, er, yeah, or like fine. easier. Uh, or whatever. The best one is Google Play. What uh, the fuck? Oh, what the fuck is wrong? The only <laughs> reason why? Listen, listen to me. What the okay. fuck is wrong? With you? The only I agree the the software on your like on your MacBook or PC. Yeah. It looks like shit. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's very un- like it's usable, but it's just garbage. Uh, but the thing is that if you have flak formats, like yeah. very high, high quality, you can actually put it on your phone and then like play it from Google Play. Yeah, where you can't do that from Spotify. You have to you have to have an independent player. Yeah, to play them. Gotcha. Where Otherwise, yeah. you, with who? Google Play, you can just use that one thing and you can play everything. You still put your music on your phone? No, but if you do have very like high wh- quality... What do you mean putting your music on like your phone? I you mean take like a thing and then you yeah, put yeah, it yeah, in like put a folder. actual files on your phone. Yeah. Oh, like transferring it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Why like, would you do that? Because you want super high definition, blah, blah, Download blah. Download Tidal. What? Tidal. Tidal has uh, has yeah. this hi fi quality uh, it's, shit. It's streaming and it has hi fi quality. Yeah. Okay. And if album and was you're produ- gonna be supporting Jay Z was produced on s- on, on Jack White. Uh, technically, I, would, I would say that. Technically, in such I would, I would support Jack White. I would say that. He's no, also no. the part a part yeah. of Tidal. Yeah. He's a partner there. Yeah, but a lot of artists were partners at first. Then, yeah. Then a lot of jumped off because it like they 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 kind of they kind of still afloat but kind of flopping. Then fl- they like changed. Beyonce. And I now, think Beyonce is still there, right? Oh, I thought you were meant Beyonce like kind of float but still flopping. Like <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, no, uh, like uh, yeah, Beyonce of course because yeah. Jay Z. Yeah, yeah. But uh, they changed like three or four CEOs in 2017, oh, which is never a good sign. Nope. They don't make money. Uh, they allegedly were caught lying about their, uh, lying to investors about their, um, sub, uh, about their uh, paid, subscri- yes, paid subscriber numbers. Bad marketing campaign. Uh, no, it's just the marketing. They just, I don't think. I'm no, lying in general is bad marketing. Yeah. yeah. I don't think people like who use it. I don't think people be like, like being oh, wait. lied. People don't like no, lying. No, but they, they lie to investors. Generally. Like, people who are users don't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah, that's true. But they lie to investors. And, like, now, Tidal isn't pr- isn't doing good. Mm. But, uh, but I don't know. I, I have Tidal, but uh, I don't use it much. Yeah. I don't even know why I'm still paying for it. But uh, How much are you paying? I support well, artists. <laughs> well, that, that's the thing about like subscription 10 services nowadays. I have years. tons of them, which yeah. I don't really use. Netflix being one of them. I also don't. Like, I use Netflix when, was like, uh, when they put out, like, uh, some kind of stand-up special. Yeah. That's yeah. That I subscribe to it. And or then a it documentary. Just, and then it just fucking stays there yeah. for the rest of yeah. eternity yeah. but you kind of but but the brand is their branding is so good netflix they're, they're so ingrained in this pop co- like it's a part of yeah, but this allure I mean, and you're oh like, yeah, yeah you're a part so, of a club if you're yeah, yeah on netflix. and it's so difficult to be like you literally you literally are throwing out with 10 euros a month right yeah, yeah, you, yeah but, but that's the thing it's just 10 euros no, 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 no i'm not saying that it's expensive it, it just, you don't even feel it that that's the problem because mm. you don't feel the impact of those 10 euros a month absolutely mm. and that's why you have this <laughs> yeah, but then you can. Uh, uh, th- th- that is fine. But you're literally, if you're not using it, you're just throwing out ten euros yeah. a month, right? Yeah. yeah. What three but beers? Two beers? But when you start beers? thinking about it, it's like maybe I should unsubscribe, and you're like, 
but it's Netflix. It's yeah. Like, yeah. You'll be like, it's because next, next time Netflix. the next good uh, stand up special comes out, you will have to resubscribe. And then you yeah, maybe, no, you don't maybe. like resubscribing is not that hard. I mean, you go on a profile and you click, uh, what is it, accept subscription or whatever because you have your card connected yeah yeah sure i know so what you're yeah I, i've done i've done that but now it's been on for like uh, for like same 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 yeah like, i don't give a shit i've done the it's thing three beers watch two this beers. one special and then, whatever. then unsubscribe but then again it's just, there's another special then there's cool documentary and stuff and then it's yeah, like, yeah then yeah. it's on forever yeah but i still i still can't get over the fact that i want to find something and then it's like not available in your region I'm like oh but the, the you can get a vpn no, but yeah, I know, I know people do with yeah, yeah, but uh, I'm not very. I love getting, savvy, so. it, but it's okay. much less of an issue recently. Like now. I, don't I, don't I know, love man. Uh, I, don't I know. love UK shows and shit. Yeah. yeah, so like. So you need the VPN. Yeah. I watched Black Mirror yesterday, the first episode. Again or no? The oh, first you've never episode. watched I have it before. Never watched oh it. my god! Yeah, let, let's so like he he hasn't listened to Brockhampton, and he watched. Black Mirror today? Brock, or yesterday? Bro, bro. Yeah, yeah, you know what? <laughs> Ep one qualifying was pretty awesome today. <laughs> there, there, there's gonna be a very unusual grid tomorrow. No, no, all those little fucking rich kids racing with the daddy's money, great. No, all in all, uh, how did you like the first episode? Uh yeah, I liked it. It was super dark. I yeah. I, I, I like that intense. That's it, why gets it gets better. That's why no, it gets better, but that's why I quit it. I'm like I can't I, it's super it's I mean the pilot like, is super it's intense. too it's too dark. Oh no, I love it's it. Too it's too dark. It's it's like my that. it's too basically it a comedy. It makes me feel uncomfortable, and I like it. I like it from from. It, the I don't know. Arc. I'm just like I'm already like. I if always you have a reference point now. Like before that, I was just talking out of my ass. Now I can always say like, you see what I mean is uh, the th third season with the phone and with the rating. Remember that? Yeah. So. That's my that greatest would, reference point I think to all the people the that are saying, no, man, you should be on social media. You know, like, no, that that episode yeah, is fine. where you're going. Listen, there's something a little bit very pretentious about about going around and referencing Black Mirror. Like, uh, yeah, I'm not saying that it's humble. not like no, 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 <laughs> no, not like, you know, That's like exactly why I do. No, not like, you know, hum no, it's just like everyone's on Black Mirror. It's like you ref yeah. like the, the I, I was. It's a great it's a great reference. Now you I mean, are. It is. It's a it's great a, example. It's it's a, a, yeah, but it's like it's so cliche and it uh, is cliche. I'll give you a, that. It's plus, not original plus to the, reference. The, Black the, the the season, the episode of the season you're talking about is yeah. the first one that uh, uh, that Netflix bought. Yeah, when Netflix bought Black Mirror Studio oh, it's or whatever. On Netflix yeah. right now. Right? Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I did not it was a UK. Yeah. Uh, it was a UK show. Okay. So I so I think the UK version the original one yeah. i liked it much better mm. than the american one the american one instantly be became this they kind of dumb it down a little no i like this it. I whole like this it. whole social like social media rating shit it's yeah. it's too obvious yeah you know what i'm saying no i mean it's not you remember you remember they had the the season one the second episode about uh people wheeling for electricity and the, yeah. the, the like yeah. either they either you're weak. rich and famous or everything is shit. Yeah, like this whole like celebrity. That, that was more like a reference to oh, to celebrity uh, um, culture. No, to um, what is it called? The American America's Got Talent and Britain's well, Got Talent. Well, it is celebrity, it's a celebrity so culture. Yeah, I, I yeah. About, it's I not just a, yeah, it's yeah. not a just reference to America's Got Talent. It's yeah. about this whole structure yeah, of yeah, yeah, of yeah. living. And now that shit fucked me up. That shit was so nuanced. Love that. It's what it, but it was nuanced. My favorite one. It was still is the the one where you can uh, see what you have done. The uh, the memory. Yeah, memory? The, the thing that yeah, you can yeah. turn and then yeah, see yeah, that fucks you up. And it's so great. Just that one scene when he walks up to the door and he can't remember what's uh, that girl's name, and yeah. he just like rewinds back and just checks. The, yeah. Okay, so, so that and that name. Perfect. Perfect. It's just yeah, like no, it's basically also a reference to our phones that we don't give a shit that now we can Google everywhere, everything all the time. So what's the like what's the point of knowing stuff? You you can Google it. But th but that wisdom has been around for a while. Einstein, yeah. I believe, said that. That's what's the point of knowing you have a you conversation. Can, go to the bathroom. What, what, what you can find out. Yeah. Yeah. It, yeah. It, like. All in all, Easily. I think it's a I, th I think it's a very great show, and I I don't think it's that dark. Like P I think no. I never felt that way, and I heard it like I think while the third season was going, and all of a sudden I heard 
I finally heard the people that were saying, oh my God, it's so dark, so controversial. Where before that, me and my friends, we thought it's a great show. Yes, it's a little bit more dark, but I mean, a lot of shows are. No, I think that's... Like, that's Game exactly, of Thrones isn't no, no, lighthearted. No, 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 but I, I think that's exactly uh, other people's points, maybe. Yeah. Because the vast majority of shows nowadays are are, are very shallow... Oh, that's what you mean. ...evening okay. time... Yeah. Bass, well, I, I wouldn't say that because like but the TV show market is higher than ever, right? No, I, I'm not saying they are doing bad. Yeah. I'm, I'm saying that they are not that thought provoking. Well, yeah, they it's very not, oversaturated. They do not. Uh, how do you say Israeli? I don't uh, sure. Entice? No. No, 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 no. no. Uh, they don't stir up the what emotion, yeah. that talking about. emotional spectrum. That dark, uh, Black Mirror does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're well, talking about like uh, I only heard the people uh, that were saying that Black Mirror is very dark around the third season because before that I only communicate with my friends about it, and all my friends were totally chill, and nobody said, "Oh my God, they just showed this." Oh. <gasps> no, it's not about it's not about them. Like, oh my God, how dare yeah. they? To this is this is too much for like, television. I can't, lo- I can't no. look at this. It's so dark. No, it's just it's it, to me. It's like I can't look at it it's so dark because. Except Do you feel the, guilty about no, it? No, except for the except for the second episode, which because because I'm a fan yeah. of pop culture, yeah, I like it, right? Mm-hmm. Because of it, the, that episode fucked me up because it was it was a from one hand reference. very showing, mm-hmm. uh, very illustrative, and from the se- from the other hand, it was very nuanced. It kind of got it wasn't this blatant like yeah. the celebrity culture. It's bad. <laughs> it was this. It was very. It got under your skin. And yeah, like, well, like, it got under like, your skin, and yeah. I think each episode is targeted towards a certain yeah, demographic. Sure. And it, it like, but it, but it, like in such a stealthy way that it just fucked me up. For it made you great. It, it made did you its feel, job. You know, I'm it, not saying it's bad. No, no, no. I, I, when I'm I say not saying that you are. When I say it's dark, I'm not yeah. saying it's 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 amazing. It's high quality. Yeah. It's 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 well thought out. Mm. Yada yada yada. But the other things are to me where so is just like you think I, uh, when I was watching, for example, the re- rewinding mm-hmm. episode. When I was watching the uh, the uh, the uh, the rating, the social media yeah, rating, yeah, which yeah. neighborhood you gonna live in episode. Mm-hmm. I was like, like yes, this is this. I uh, uh, have some water. Yeah, sure. Uh, this I understand. This is great. But I was like, you think I haven't thought about this? Like you think this kind of a concept but has since never we're such been visual in, beings. I has, mean, it no, means no, no. a lot. I get it, but to me, it to me it was like if you're gonna if, to me it was like if you're gonna somehow tw- not even twist it, but if you, if you're gonna somehow like oh the censorship sh- thing that was good as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, that was really. But again, good. it's like you, like you have you've never re- you've never thought no, about this it's, idea it's a before. Direct reference to the thing that happened in America. Absolutely, and it was kind of mind blowing. But yeah. you've never thought you've never had a similar. I'm not saying like one there's one one. I, I'm one. just saying that, that there's something different seeing it visually. That's the thing. I just think as yeah, of I, course you have yeah, a lot of dark I, I, shit I, in your mind I, that I, you I have thought about. I think that's that is the thing uh, which like you thought about it, but that that thought and they never just they made a good it, it, illustration. It, it, it exactly. never made you feel the way that episode about that yeah. thought made you feel. Whereas you're thinking about it, seeing it, and experiencing it is yeah, way it, more uh, as a memorabilia it, than yeah, just like thinking about it in your kitchen while you're making food. It's like, hey, what if it like? No, but it's it's just like I'm all like I don't I don't need. I don't like. Sometimes I want to be asleep. Sometimes uh, uh, I don't want to be dumbfounded. I don't want to be. I don't want to be that woke. I don't want to be like because like I'm. No, no, no. I'm. I'm good. I've. I've got enough shit in my head to think about, (laughs) and not like mental health issues wise, but just like, like concepts and ideas wise, just like society and politics. I'm. I'm. I'm already in that space. I don't yeah. need you to add more. Not in. Not. Not like content wise. Yeah. I'm not saying that my my shit in my head is better than yours. Not yeah. saying that. I'm saying that it's already kind of dark and negative. Yeah. 
I'm fine because I already I, I understand what you're talking about. To me, it's not a revelation. That's mm-hmm. why I like the second episode because I understood what they're talking about 100. Yeah. percent But they but they somehow really got under my skin. They managed it. And I'm like, okay, that's not like res- respect to that. Why are destroying? I'm destroying yeah. the yeah. trash. It's but not, uh, was yeah. but, purpose. but everything else was like was like I've it's just I've I I know like social media rate this whole shit like. I know. Yeah. That's why I don't want to think about it yeah. no more. Like I, I guess know. it just really like resonates a lot with me because like I'm not on social media mm. and I'm I'm really th- for maybe, that. Maybe, and it feels maybe like it supports I'm, it yeah, supports no, no your lifestyle. No judging that you don't like yeah, yeah, it exactly, or not watching it. No, no, just, no. those no. are those exact reasons you're explaining why you are not watching it anymore. Yeah. Uh, are the reasons why either people might call it dark and weird and exactly. you, because it makes you feel the way it makes you ways be too you have not felt ever. No, the f- emotion wise yeah, yeah, yeah i agree that, but this thing. whole like you got to be like yeah maybe f- maybe the maybe people who who never thought about the concepts that they're talking about yeah It's just to me, it's hard to believe. That must be crazy, mind blowing. If you yeah, watch, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, Maybe, yeah, they, they, that that shit hits them like a motherfucking train. Yeah, but to me, it's like since I've already thought about it, it's like it's not a, like a revelation. Yeah, it's just, it's it's just adding up the dark light on what yeah, yeah, I but, already but, but, kinda yeah, but, know. But you're yeah, s- telling it yourself now that. It makes you feel uncomfortable. Not, it's not about you. Not, no, no, no. It doesn't make me feel uncomfortable because of the idea. Yeah, yeah. The but idea. It, I'm not. It does. It's I the know, ideas are I not know, a revelation. It's. I'm not talking about ideas. I'm talking about how the show makes you feel. It doesn't matter what made you feel that way because I watched Ooh. the first episode. The music was a huge part of. The first episode is one of the worst. Yeah, it's a Just, it's a I, horrible I, I, pilot. I'm, I'm, it's a horrible I'm pilot. I'm not saying it's a great episode or some mm. shit, but it it made me feel no, and, no, and, and, it, and, and rarely shows nowadays do that. I mean, well, not even Game of it's Thrones. Just, it's just no, no, total the thing is, I never, never watched Game of Thrones, but yeah. Uh, the thing with you, it's not really fair to compare. First of all, it's not a TV series that is ongoing and telling an ongoing story. It's an it's, anthology. It's a mini series. No, it's an antho- anthology okay. series. Okay, yeah. Wh- whatever, whatever. All in all, and and it has such a direct reference to pop culture and and social to society, media yeah. to society in general. And none of the shows really want to reflect that as much as Black Mirror wants. Yeah, it. Which like is, which if you're is watching cool some shitty Big Bang Theory, no, there, but, um, there are. N- the you know, I get like. First of all, the, you don't they're have not to compare shows that you can Big compare Bang it to, Theory, basically. Like, Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, there are like Mi- if Mr. You, Robot, maybe Mr. Robot. Kind of. Yeah, you is can kind do of that. The, the, Mr. Robot is another one that was like it's a great show. It's yeah. super yeah, well done. But first of all, I know the like y- the conspiracy. You don't like it? Uh, no, I just got bored. This whole, this whole, uh, this whole Uncle Sam deep state yeah. conspiracy shit. I'm. N- I'm. I'm already aware of it. You're just adding. Like you're making. You're the most. No, no, no. It's just I've. It's like it's referencing a lot of uh, m- m- both Mr. Robot mm-hmm. and uh, and Black Mirror. It's ref- referencing a lot of documentaries, a lot of uh, uh, a lot of uh, not so crazy conspiracy theories. Mm-hmm. It's referencing a lot of shit that if you're interested in it, mm-hmm. you've already heard it. I'm not saying it's not. It's great. They've yeah. done it amazingly, mm-hmm. right? It's just if the like if it doesn't like. If it doesn't hit me like a train, it doesn't make you what 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 it does to you. It may you say that the you know the uh, the uh, the advantage of it is that it actually makes you feel, which in in these in this day and age, not a lot of shows do for you, right, Richard? Yeah. Right. To me, it they don't like they don't make me feel as in oh like I want to hype. Yeah, it. it's ma- just they make you feel. That's it. Th- they I- make me feel what I've already felt when I saw other shit that references it. And I've thought, and when I've thought about it, yeah, I'm fine. I'm good on that. Mm. No, yeah, that's that's totally understandable. That yeah, that's sense. why that's why I stopped watching. Yeah, it. Yeah, 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 that makes makes a lot of sense. Miss Robot was saying, but Miss Robot was also incredibly well done. No, no, it's incredibly it, well the, done. The, the Mr. Robot, what is it? Uh, whatever, it doesn't matter. The the, the IT. Uh, no, no, no. That's guy? that's what I remember. But I there was a cinematographer that was very, mm. I think, uh, yeah. 
yeah. around yeah. before and then when everybody heard that he's making Mr. Robot, yeah. then everybody's like, oh, this shit must look good and it does. So yeah, yeah, just, it was, it was yeah. very good. Yeah, it's, it's not still, only written it's well, but just shot well and yeah. Yeah. It's great. It's, great. it's all around. Yeah, so you should listen to Brockhampton. Yeah, Brockhampton. Yeah. Shout. I, I will. I yeah. will tonight. You're gonna, I'm uh, gonna have a chill. Even I'm gonna go home and, and fucking uh, put it on my speakers. That. Yeah, my <laughs> loud speakers. Yeah, I can Definitely. listen to it in my car. Okay, but um, I can. I you can't. I have old shitty car and and like you have an it, Audi. But yeah, but it doesn't have any Bluetooth connection or or oh, aux the, uh, or some shit. Uh, but uh, not aux. You can, I think you can plug it in through you, if you buy the you, adapter. Y- yeah, you can plug it in through the the the, the, the cigarette. Shit. No, no, that that sucks. That's. Yeah. I'm not saying it's it, good, but yeah, it's, yeah, it's you better than nothing. It, but you can actually... Just play it, it on your phone. It, it's not, it's not that Put hard. Put it in a cup. Yeah. <laughs> I, I've listened to podcasts like that. I have this... That's uh, fine. The some, podcast some like really whatever. Uh, some time ago, McDonald's were handing out um, like cup holders, but for fries. Okay. Which is like which is like a fry-shaped cup. You okay. Put it, you put it in your... It has a round thing underneath. Oh, yeah. You put it in your cup holder and you can put your fries in it. I'm all, all, all but instead all about of fries, that you put I, I, your phone. Yeah, 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 and I have it in my cup holder. Yeah, and it's very convenient to put keys in it, yeah, like yeah, phone yeah. and some shit, and then you put on a podcast and it kind of amplifies the yeah, sounds, yeah, yeah, yeah. and it's like you can. Listen I don't know to that, that that's fine, but music's a little bit different. I no, would I course. would say I, put I, it on your speed. I, I never listen to shitty shitty. Because yeah. like equipment. I walk around uh, around my house, especially if I'm cleaning and anything. Yeah. I'm, if I'm listening to a podcast. Then I'm just putting my phone in my pocket, and because uh, I have flatmates, so I can't put it on speakers like yeah. so that it bombs yeah, through the whole house. Yeah, but you have kick-ass bosses though, and you can like. That's also true. That's also you true. Can listen and to I have kick-ass on. Yamaha speakers that are fucking fire. My JBLs are the best. <laughs> yeah, everybody's speakers are the best. Yeah. I have no idea what's in my car. I just it's fine. Yeah, it's whatever. It's, it's, it, it's it makes fine. noise. It makes noise. <laughs> it's like I'm not and a lot of bass. But yeah. bass is important in cars. Yeah, I don't know. I, it, I, it's I, the I, most. It's adjustable. Thing. I'm aware of it, but I'm not a fan of bass. So well, adjusting. you're not tech savvy. So not obviously, you're not yeah. at all. No, no. I like. It's like to me. To, to me, here, there's only two territories. Either it sounds bad or it sounds. This is good. a speaker, and yeah. this is a spoon. Great. I know the difference. Moving the fuck on. It's not that <laughs> fucking bad, but uh, mm, uh, yeah. But Amir, you don't give a shit. That's what I mean. Like basically, it's it, not that I don't get. I w- it's just uh, yeah, I'm not. I'm not ready to invest my time. Exactly, and it's you're like, gonna I've go to a store. This guy you're gonna talk to yeah. a person, and you're gonna say, "Hey, I need some shit that sounds good," and he's gonna give you top five, and you're gonna pick whatever f- finds fancy your wallet, and uh, yeah, you're gonna leave with that. You you don't give a shit. That's no, what I, mean, I wouldn't right? even do that. No, not even that. So you just. Okay. Nah, I don't like. Yeah. Nah, I just don't like. Uh, so okay, let's let's put you in a in a scenario. Dude, I was I was feeling I was uh I had to uh to export uh a, a, a huge like a twenty gigabyte file for yeah. the podcast the Ryan All movie, right. and my computer was like my, my MacBook was mm-hmm. huffing and puffing. Yeah. And but I felt. But that's what every yeah, MacBook yeah. does. Yeah, yeah. But do usually that. my MacBook does not huff and puff. You know why? Because what I do with it, I just serve the internet. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So and I was kind of feeling sorry for my for my for my notebook. <laughs> I was like, hey, you gonna? Be I was okay? like, I was like, shit. Is it? You're, you're gonna like, have a me time. Isn't it gonna blow up? Yeah. Is it gonna like blow? Like what? My mom up? calls like, me from uh, time to time when she does something intense on her laptop. Yeah. And she's like, hey, it's doing stuff. I'm like, yeah, that's yeah, what. That's what it's made that, for, that, right? That, the laptop. G- no, it's good that it's doing it because yeah. exactly. if it was silent, then you after yeah. like an hour you won't, yeah, you, you won't have your MacBook yeah. anymore. Oh, so it has to. The fact that the fact it's a fan yeah, that's making yeah. a lot of noise because it's cooling your shit. Yeah, so but it, it still get it hot. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, but yeah. without it's not, it, you it, it would overheat. Ba- basically, off. it it can get to I don't know like ninety five to a hundred and still run. Yeah, and it would. It's not good. Like the threshold, I think it's like you shouldn't keep it for, for seventy-five, like that, for eighty-five for degrees. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's that's like that's enough. And then it, all the rendering noises. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Designers can relate. Yeah. yeah, but let's put you in a scenario. So, like, since you don't do that shit that I said before, so you want a speaker. Let's say you want a Bluetooth speaker because you want to be fancy and sit in a picnic and listen yeah. to your music in Brokehampton and all yeah. that. So what do you do? What, how do you buy it if you're not like which one would yeah, I yeah. buy? Like you go you go to a store. There's a I'm not shelf. going to a store. 
Like, come on, what, okay, what is you're it, going... like 2008 or 2009? <laughs> Who the fuck goes okay, to a store? You're, you're, you're going online. Uh, I'm, go- I'm just going to, yeah, you know, I'm going to do the simpleton shit. I'm going to Google, uh, like, uh, speakers fucking... of 2018. Yeah. God damn it. Yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm aware of the yeah. I'm aware of the brands, but you know, I like like I like cool shit. Yeah, so and it has I'm, to look cool. It has to sound cool. Yeah, and, so I'm just and it like, has to be number five. Be, be, because no, no. actually, I do that as well, but because I don't want to miss out on some yeah, novelty. Yeah, definitely. definitely. Maybe there's and there's a up reason up why stuff is popular, and, and 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 maybe it's worth looking at. I don't. I, haven't heard of that brand or something. Yeah. yeah, no, I would just go, I, I, I'm the opposite. I would go with a brand that I've that I've seen somewhere, not in terms of uh, not in terms of performance, mm-hmm. but in terms of pop culture. Like uh, they influence me like that. I, I'm if I have to buy uh, a, a Bluetooth speaker, I'm buying Beats. If I have to buy, really? yeah, I'm telling you, this okay. is the way it is. If I have to okay, buy as long head- as you're not buying Beats head the headphones, I'm fine uh, that's what exactly what I want to next. If I have to buy headphones, I'm buying Beats headphones. I don't give a fuck. Like they I have, look cool. I have now pop turned culture. good. Uh, Let's go. Four people away from Beats into my headphones. I'm so I'm happy. Not, yeah, the, they are good. They are, but I, 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 I use Beats. Yeah, but I, I love them because which, which ones are yours? Bose QC35. I know Bose as well. Yeah, but with noise canceling. Yeah. Right. The best noise Here's canceling the headphones yep, in the yep, business. Yep, I agree. I'm mean, not even. I, first of all, I have no idea, so I'm not mm-hmm. arguing that. Right? Mm-hmm. That is totally fine. Yeah. But then, and w- we get back to the initial point. I really don't give a flying yeah, fuck. Yeah. So as long as they're not actually screeching and huffing and yeah. puffing in my fucking ears, yeah. I got beats on. Yeah. I'm good. Yeah, 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 I get that. It's just that the fact why I love them really much because I am tech savvy. Yeah. Is the fact that like uh, they're Lewis Hamilton dy- wears them. Also, uh, <laughs> Lewis Hamilton fact, is like, such a high beast. He, I, I, I thought you would wear be dude. That motherfucker went sneaker shop and went <laughs> and bought the lamest sneakers ever. I yeah. fucking uh, yeah. Lewis Hamilton was supposed to wearing beats. He's such a fucking high beast. Yeah. But basically, it's the dynamic noise canceling thing. Gotcha. Is basic. They what does noise canceling do? Cancel noise? Yeah, uh, they pick up out their. Frequency. What exactly? Yeah. How exactly? It manifests basically, itself? there's there are yeah, two ways. Silent, there's the Bose silent. way. Don't, don't hear anything. Yeah, there's the Bose way and there's the Beat way. The Beat way is basically they have a, like you know an equalizer. Yeah. And yeah. So just I have imagine. I no idea what it does though. <laughs> yeah. Basically, it finds specific sounds, and they have an algorithm for beats. Where they have specifically picked out like the most common sounds and then just down everything volume down yeah. so that it cancels out the most common noises around it. Yeah. The difference between that and Bose is that Bose has microphones around mm-hmm. the headset. Yeah. So that it picks up noise. Live noise. Live noise. So uh-huh. it, if you're standing on a highway and yeah. if you're standing in a metro, mm-hmm. it's gonna be different noise canceling. Because it's going to adapt to the environment and just cancel it out. They, yeah. they ultimately do the same thing as yeah, these, yeah. but they do it dynamically and depending on, on the outer environment. And yeah, yeah it's second to none. And you can wear them for eight hours and not feel any strain on your... Like, on, yeah. on, Which is on true your, with beats. It's, yeah. it's not true with beats. Okay. They're heavier and so on. These yeah, are because fucking These are one well. of the best cops, I think, because yeah, yeah. they really nicely fit around your ears. Yeah, yeah boy. And yeah, they're fucking okay. expensive. Oh, yeah. fucking exp- okay, gotcha. Yeah. Okay. But they are beats expensive. They, they're not more Beats are more expensive than these. Yeah, I think, my, uh, I think yeah. the the yeah. beat equivalent to these is three ninety nine uh yeah. Euros. These I bought I for three seventy, something like that. Yeah. Yeah. You can get it them on discounts yeah, for, yeah, yeah. for like three hundred sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they released another one, which is really funny. The only difference between this and the newer model is the fact that the newer model has a Google Now or a Siri button. That's it. It's the only yeah. Thing. Okay. You let's, don't care. Let's not, no, 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 I don't. Uh, I just hear the no, huffing please, and please puffing. Please do not hijack my podcast. The, no, the huffing and the podcast. puffing. It's not a tech it podcast. It shouldn't huff and puff. So it if you're huffing and puffing, huff and puff. Yeah, 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 that's that's, and this should look cool and. Be, yeah. and, and, and since it, you're it screeching and huffing and puffing now. We need to move on. It has to be like a, a, a point of reference somewhere. Yeah. 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 Um, how much time? Like, wh- how, how long we've we been running for? Hour and a half. Hour, Hour and a half. Thirty eight yeah. minutes. Perfect. Last topic. Last topic. Uh, yes. Uh, Another one. You're putting everything, uh, even yourself, on a stage. I don't know what the last topic is. I know. You know. Yeah. Go for it. 
Yeah. So in connection with Amir Van. Okay. Being booted from Brock Brockhampton okay. because of sexual allegations yeah. of whatever. Yeah. Right now there's this whole scandal about uh, Asia Argento, which is this. Uh, Who this that? Uh, that's a uh, uh, she's a, an actress and a director. That that was one of the first uh, females that came out uh, with the uh, Harvey Weinstein allegations. Okay. And she kind of become uh, became this unspoken leader of the okay. Me Too movement. Okay. And now there's this guy who's like 23 now, something like that. And when he was 17, he says that an Asia Argento was like uh, 37. Oh, she she fucked him All right. and paid him hush money. Okay. Ooh. Um, a leader of the Me Too movement. Yeah. A woman. Yeah. Fucked a minor. Yep. And paid him hush money. Yeah. That's awkward. That's pretty controversial. Yeah. It's pretty in your face. Can't go around it, though. I don't know yeah. what to say about that. Like, it's stupid. That's it. <laughs> like, shouldn't have done it. But I, but it, what Mon- is the, money ain't going to fix it. I mean, it. what is the, what is the difference? Uh, but there, there should be a difference between, uh, between wom- a woman forcing a guy to have sex versus is there a difference is that that's definitely a difference it, it's there's I, there must unless the guy was gay and he's actually repulsed by women for example yeah and somehow she fucks him yeah i think then the guy i, I re- think that that's a problem re- because he starts to question his sexuality he starts really like what the fuck but was it if he's not gay and a woman takes advantage of a man you don't think it's right I think you no, you, it's appropriate to call rape. Yeah. I just think that uh, vi- uh, vice versa, mm-hmm. it's a different level to it's it. Much, no, no, it's, it's much defini- less dense. Yeah. It's yeah. it's definitely different. I but think no, I, I but fully uh, agree. But, but also still rape. Yeah, but like yeah. You see what I mean? No, no, still listen, rape. Listen, if I'm like just a little bit, right? no, a little bit. Uh, if if I'm gonna if I'm gonna forcefully take your finger, okay, I'm gonna put it in my mouth. Okay. Forcefully. You did not want that. Can you do that? No, no, no let's find out. No, we're not gonna. Uh, so if see, I'm... See, 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 we're getting off uh, on a good start. No, no. You don't want to. <laughs> you see, there's already, there's gonna be something you don't rape, want to be rape, done to you. Rape. No, listen. <laughs> so if I'm gonna take your finger and forcefully put it in my mouth. Keep talking. In your mouth. No, my mouth. Keep talking. <laughs> your mouth, my mouth. No. Everyone's mouth. Your finger and my you mouth. You got a finger. You forcefully. got a finger. And you got a no, finger. No, no. Here, your yeah, mouth, yeah. Listen for the for the next recording. I think we have to take off your microphone. Here's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing. No, imagine like the emotion. Uh, okay. You're not gonna. I mean, you if you didn't want it, right? Yeah. You're not gonna. You're gonna be like, ah, oh, what the fuck, fuck. Like I didn't really enjoy that. Right. 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 Well, you just imagine the emotion. It's like it's like you're just gonna fucking like rub your finger against mm-hmm, your your mm-hmm, clothes mm-hmm. or whatever to make mm-hmm. it dry and shit. Why are you making it so no, detailed, no, no. man? It has to be detailed. Okay. It has to be detailed. Now imagine if I forcefully put my finger in your mouth. Okay. That's a different feeling. That's that's a different level. Mm-hmm. That's a different no, but level. Yes, I'm. I'm not. It's definitely more intense. Yeah. Okay. I'm not denying that at any point. I'm just saying, it's still right. No, I'm not saying. That. But was it though? I mean, specifically in that situation, because they had a pre. Because the a definition of rape is taking advantage of another person who doesn't consent to no, the. No, I'm booking. saying that. In, no, no, I'm not saying that a woman cannot rape a, a, a man. I'm mm-hmm. not saying that. I'm saying that in that specific situation, where seven. I mean, th- when she was oh, 37, okay. she didn't look that bad. I mean, she was fine. Uh, oh no, that's not. I'm not no, saying that's right. I, I'm that specific I'm, situation. Yeah. Where, you know, she kind of like they already had a pre-existing relationship mm-hmm. because when he was a kid, he was uh, he, he started in her movie yeah. and shit like that. And they always had this, f- well, if you think about it, fucked up son and mother kind of nurturing relationship. Yeah. And then she gets him into uh, How gets is she? him. Hmm? How old is she? Now she's like 42. It was five years ago. He was 17. She was 37. So now he ah, she gets him fine. in a hotel room because they they, they arranged the Why meeting. do I don't mind? Why do I... That's <laughs> the point. You see? You t- I don't mind. That's the point. No, you no, don't no. mind. Vice versa. No. I don't mind. 
But if, if, the, if it's a thirty-seven a man and a seventeen-year-old yes. girl, you don't mind. No, it's the f- if both people are giving consent. But w- yeah, but nah, but no, but if what if consent was not given? Okay, but that's a, a what if. Yeah, but if a woman kind of, but if a, but if, it, if if it was still if forceful, a thirty-seven-year-old woman and a seventeen-year-old yeah. guy fuck and the guy didn't give consent, that's rape. Yeah, but it's still like in the Me Too we're era. Not gonna, we're not gonna. In the Me Too era, he comes out. He comes out saying that hey, like, uh, because of because of sh- her becoming this uh, this symbol of the Me Too movement. Yeah. Well, that makes it really say, just no, really stupid out, and controversial. He, no, he, yeah, but he comes out with a like with a, a with an all that flow yeah, statement. Exactly. He comes out like like seeing her talking about being abused by Harvey Weinstein yeah. kind of reminded me of those fucked up emotions how of how I felt when yeah. when she, when she abused me and then she paid them hush money it's like if you're going to if you're going to as a guy in the me too era if you're going to if you're going to come, if you're gonna come out as uh uh, you know, as saying that a woman abused you, yeah. you have to come out swinging. Um, I, you have to come out swinging. It's like, yo, this bitch, you know, like, yo, this <laughs> bitch. No, seriously, you have to change up the flow. Yeah. Like, if everyone's mumble rapping, you have to do something different. <laughs> okay, okay. See you have point. to change up the flow. Yeah. You have to come out swinging and saying, listen, I don't know what what, what fuck y'all were thinking about, but this Me Too chick, <laughs> who's your fucking symbol, yeah. has been fucking around and raping minors. Including me. Yeah. Like I don't know. Like I don't. I don't know. You can do with your Me Too movement whatever the fuck you want. Mm-hmm. But not her. Fuck that bitch. He has to come out swinging. Now he had to come out swinging, not with a statement of the same statement that all of the all of the female victims were coming out. For example, when uh, when the Aziz and Star Aziz and Sari story broke out. Well, this it was completely like it was whatever. Yeah, but he won an Emmy. I'm really not entertained by this news. Like, if yeah. I would go through a news article yeah. and that would shit would pop up, I would yeah. be like, whatever, man. Yeah, okay. Like, yeah, but no, no, no. It's yeah. just it matters. It yeah. matters for pop culture. It matters. God damn it. A big deal. Yeah. So when he sure, so, sure, it's I I get how that's news since it's so controversial. Yeah. But I couldn't give a shit less. No, no. Uh, it's like I I don't know. Kanye dropping three albums. Yeah, I'll, I'll five, read. five. Drop what five? This. Oh wait a minute. Yeah, drop five. This year. Daytona. Yeah. Daytona. Daytona. Yay. Kids Kids see ghosts. ghosts. Uh, the Tiana Taylor album. Go uh, keep the same energy. Yeah. And the fifth one was uh, which one? Nas. 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 All right, yeah. Nas. You know why everyone forgot? forgot? Flopped. Well, yeah. The the album is. Mm-mm. Yeah, you liked it, but it flopped. The the thing is that like, I liked the first half ish. It's not a lot of songs to like. So it's not a lot of songs to like. <laughs> I like the first I, half. It's I not think, A side and B side. <laughs> yeah, I think it 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 flopped because it's not that good. It's just like, uh, even Daytona isn't that good, but Daytona is better. Uh, Daytona is fine. Yeah, where they, like Nas Daytona was just really. Just, I don't know. Nas, it's, it, it wasn't. I mean, it's either a hit or miss, and it's more a miss than a hit. Yeah, it was. It wasn't. It wasn't like a. Oh my god, what, no, what did you do with Nas, Kanye? But it's just. It is it is is the same thing with if people decide it's not a good album. It's not a good album. You might like it, but it's no, just no, not a good I, album. The thing is that I. It's it's in the background. It's going on, and I'm no, like, okay, a, yeah, you and know, I'm nodding my head. A, there's and there's a, a beat. There's, and there's a there's reason. A, there's some noise. There's a reason. Why we for like we we had to we we had we needed extra ten seconds to well, to remember about the fifth albums like okay Kanye did this is no, 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 oh no, no, no. Nas right no, 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 it's just no. just, just because that's, fucking yeah, Kanye released five albums that's why because Tiana Taylor's album is as forgettable mm, not to me no not to you yeah but, you, but, but because you're right. I, and you you're right. did not forget about it you're right you're right but Nas like. Everyone forgot Nas in this room. Yeah, but just because everybody you, forgot about Daytona as well. Yeah, but Daytona. No, no, no. Because Daytona. No, I think I, people did. People love Daytona. People loved Daytona. Mm. Trust me. You don't have to no, like no, it. People love no, Daytona. No, I I do like Daytona. But the fact is that I think people maybe heard a little bit it over, and now it's gone. 
Yeah. It's the same with Nas, but Kids yeah. See Ghosts like, like, still like happening. Like Kids Yay. See Ghosts all not other happening. Albums Kids See Ghosts Kanye's not album. happening. Kids, Kids See Go- Ghosts is? not happening. People still are... No. Yo. Yes. No. Yo. Yes. Yo, man. No. It's the same thing with Ye. No. Ye no. is still Ye? happening. Ye, even... even Listen, Ye it's is not happening a, less than Kids See Ghosts. Yeah, think. definitely. It, all of those albums are happening already less. It's the album cycle now. What the fuck y'all talking about? I don't know. Like what? Like it's happened. Like what, I. St- why do you have to what, be so rude? Though? No. What's now? No, what's not now? Being rude. Tell I, me. What's now? I'm. What's now? Yeah. Whatever. Whatever came out now. No. No. What's I now? mean, what I what I mean by that is, the people that listen to Yay Daytona Kids See Ghosts. Yeah. What are they listening to now? I'm still listening to those the same albums you just named. My point exactly. But it no no it's not in the conversation no more. And what? It's not in conversation. Why? Because it's he not. decided. <laughs> no, that way. no, not because I decided. Because it's it's not it's not hard to gauge what people are talking about no, on no, social definitely media. Definitely, it's we're, not difficult. We're, like it's a centrifuge that like more shit is coming out and we're getting bombarded with well, a lot well, of music. Travis Scott is gonna happen for a while. Travis now. Scott is what people are on now. Travis mm. Scott is what people are talking about. I don't believe that all the people that are listening no, to them getting those the albums getting are the point. just like minimizing no. all the windows and just opening up fucking Travis Scott no it's not, I you're not doing no that. no no you you no it's not it's not an action by action it's not like that yeah but though but uh but those uh Kitsy well, goes can, Kitsy can, goes can you, did not can you like look up like uh statistics on streaming numbers yeah, yeah. try to stream what are you streaming numbers on the on the albums which is the most popular yeah, yeah, yeah. oh will, you can look it up now no, no, I'm, you're I'm, not going to find you're not no, no, going to find yeah you're not going to find Kitsy goes how, not 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 whether or not, but how, yeah. how many? Yeah, I just want to see is like the which is the most popular out of five. Yeah, yeah three, let's like let's guess. Last week. I'm saying yay. kids, kids yay. see ghosts. Obviously, yay. Kids see ghosts. No, yay. Probably yay. <laughs> I have Actually, no idea. I'm it's pretty, yay. But it's good that we have tell- two different. I even, I even, I remember Complex did uh, the uh, the whole comparison of yeah. all five albums based by statistics. Okay, okay. But it was like, but, but it, it's a little bit outdated now because like based on first or second week or yeah. whatever. Yeah, just go on Spotify. Just go on Spotify and look look up. Oh, no, no, you're you not gonna. It's not gonna be that okay. easily searchable. No, no, we gotta do it. We gonna do it, and then we are gonna end. The thing. Uh, oh my god! Oh my god! Accept it. Fuck so it. okay. What's that? No, it's no. You're just. Thing. It's not gonna. You're not gonna easily search for the official streaming numbers today of the of those five albums. It's not gonna be that easy. Okay. I'm telling you. The, the, yay! Okay. Yay! Just just by I'm pretty just, sure just you're by right. sheer I would popularity just love of to Kanye. See the, uh, the numbers. You I like, like numbers. Kits, You just like Kitsy Ghost. Kitsy Ghost. Oh no! I like Yay more. Yeah, but you, you but you, yeah. but you think Kitsy Ghosts is it doesn't uh, support my point. <laughs> no, is you you think that Kitsy Ghosts is but people listen to it more? It's just yeah, not. Th- it's not true. No, no, I'm 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 saying that because I'm talking from my bubble. My bubble is the people that I watch, the people that I listen to, in regards to music, the people that I know personally that listen to music, basic people, musicians, whatever. Like you know the the the, the gray matter, the yeah. basic the basic ones, uh, and all of most of the pe- I would say eighty yeah. percent of the people enjoyed Kitsy Ghosts most, and are still listening to Kitsy Ghosts. That's why, because my I bubble. Get I get what you're saying. Your yeah. bubble, yeah, that's yeah, yeah, it. I get what you're saying, and no, that's why that, that's why probably my by numbers yeah. by numbers by numbers I'm pretty sure the gay, gay was gay just gay, because it's just, Kanye's album. Exactly. The second one was actually Daytona. Because it because uh, because people were talk because it was the first album that came out by Kanye so it so it kind of got a lot yeah, of attention. Wasn't it also I think like a Pusha T's revival or some shit. I think it has to be Kids See Ghosts because, 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 because Kid production. Production. Yeah. is just like stupid basic. What? And I, I think it had the second one biggest numbers has yeah. to be Kids See Ghosts no, just because. No, no, it was Daytona. No, the first week numbers. We're talking about oh, first, first week, week numbers, numbers. Okay. obviously. I'm uh, overall. Daytona sold yeah. first week streamed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Combined, sold more. Yeah, I'm not surprised Kids, by that. It was, I think it was, yeah, it was Yay, uh, Daytona, Kitsy Ghosts, mm-hmm. uh, Na- Nas or Tiana. Uh, those two, I don't know. <laughs> but Yay was definitely. That doesn't matter. Because Yay sold, uh, Yay sold two, 205K first week. 
Yeah. Uh, Daytona was 70 something and Kit Seagull was like was 52 some shit. Yeah. So it's just and then it's just goes It's really all from weird there. like especially uh, if we're talking about Kid Sea Ghosts uh, and about my tiny little bubble of people and and information It and was a that. great album. I liked it. It's weird how I like I can respect that it's quality, but personally I don't like it. It's like whatever. I I I do see a lot of production I don't, lyrically yeah. it's uh it's it everything's good. The album is great. But personally, I don't. Th- I haven't put it on. No, no, it was after, supposed to be. Yeah. After I listened, none. No, I no. have. I have listened to it just because I want. Like it was not enough. It was not enough Kanye verses on Ye for mm-hmm. me. So I just needed more Kanye verses. Oh no, I I still listen to Ye. But uh, yeah, yeah me Kanye too. Yeah. Addictions getting oh, out of yeah. hand. Yeah, yeah, Kanye is amazing. Yeah, and, boy. And uh, but you could see Ghost was was it it was as you said very good quality and mm-hmm. stuff like that. But it didn't. It it was supposed to leave a bigger impact. It was supposed to be better. And is the theory such as uh, we're gonna get another Kid C Ghost album? I think so. Yeah, I that's think the so. point. That's they're the actually uh, Tyler the Creator has a as a no no, no it's not a but I don't think oh. it's gonna be what you're thinking. Kid Tyler, Cudi, no. Kanye West, and Tyler. Let's yeah. go. Yeah, no, Tyler the Creator has this amazing camp flagno flagno whatever the fuck um, yeah. annual festival. Yeah. And one of the headliners is Kitsy Ghost. Not oh, Kanye right. West and Kid Cudi, but mm-hmm. Kitsy Ghost. I think they're going to be But then again, it's like they're planning of hey, they might they, they might come out with a statement. I think it was already like rumored that, you know, there will be more like Kit C Ghost band yeah. well, albums. There, there has to and be. that might never come into fruition. Yeah. I just, I'm not a fan of Kit Cudi. Just not. I'm not a fan either. That, I think. I but hear I think his voice and I'm turned off. Y- no, nah, I think his humming is really cool. But, uh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> no, I think that. You and as, ar- uh, as an artist, you're humming great. Yeah, but. <laughs> no, Kit, no. <laughs> Kit, Kit Cudi just, it was, uh, I didn't. I didn't, yeah, I didn't know about it before, but Kid Cudi like left a huge impact with his Man on the Moon albums. With the uh, no, I you're don't. gonna li- yeah, 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 I, I, I can I, try. I didn't know either. I didn't know either. Yeah. But I was listening to a lot of interviews of just like people who were teens back then, yeah. like famous-ish people who were teens back then. Ninety-nine percent. When it came to Kit Cudi, they were saying that Travis Scott said it, uh, Pete Davidson said it, of the SNL guy. All like, all what ev- the only thing that I've heard was that Kit Cudi saved my life. I don't know. Okay, cool. I wasn't I wasn't even listening to Kit Cudi back then, and I wasn't around this whole did fucking. Did it save your life? No, it did not. Maybe I may, may, maybe I should have listened to more Kit Cudi when I was like sixteen something. But he had huge hits on those albums. He had huge hits on those albums. A couple of, like, a lot of songs, not a lot of songs, but a couple of songs were great. And uh, Kevin was so fast that we, now we know that you don't wash your hands after... Uh, I washed my uh, hands. I'm joking. It was just Got really to. quick. Um, and uh, He yeah. was washing his hands. No. That's besides the point. In, no. w- w- there was a joke there? No. Okay. Yeah, there was, but then I stopped. like in his pee or something, or that's what you—that's what you want to say, <laughs> that's right? A horrible joke. <laughs> did you did that, at least put I mean, an okay, effort? I, my wait a minute, I can make but a horrible. That's why I stopped it. You uh, wait a minute. Let's go around the table to. and make really bad jokes. Hey, you know what the giraffe's favorite food is? Pussy. Nectarines. Oh, got you. Mm, mm. Do you know how to stop your baby from spinning? No. Uh, from going in circles. How? You nail the other hand to the ground. Oh. Jesus fucking Christ. It yeah, was he's going to be Jesus podcast. if you nail both. <laughs> Thank you for listening. <laughs> Let's Goodbye. Go.